Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Kip Tesla. Welcome to episode 8, what do we agree on, of Psychonauts 2. Hello there, everyone in chat. Hello, Mayo. Mayo Hazard. <laughs> Before the opening hours. How you doing, Mayo? Gamut. Wishing you already a great day at work, man. The less work you have, the better off we all are, isn't it? Love, that's a very nice emote. I've never seen it. I've seen it go to emote, but I've never seen Galaxy Unpacked before. Least, you know, I've never seen it used, so that's the thing now. I love that. Too bad that they're not like animated, you know, in the wall here on the screen. They are in the little chat, but not in the screen. All right, so we're meeting, we're meeting another one of the original Psychic Six. That's the plan at least. Oh, hello, Beaver. Oh, bye, Beaver. And we're getting the final uh, mental power. This is where we stopped last time. Oh my god, literally where we stopped. Stop. That, that's where the checkpoint is. I didn't want to go in, you know, and start the story and then just end it there. It's much better if we... Oh, I need, need to hear a little bit like that. There you go. I can hear the swarm. Need that. And I remember I was amazed I can move and dodge and do everything. Well, oh, yep, you can dodge. I was gonna... Yeah. <laughs> can't dodge except uh, when you're in honey which is just like pressing anything oh look at that no surprise there huh <laughs> the bees have terminated the program <laughs> so it's gonna be that kind of evening twitch huh well yesterday was pretty cool we didn't have any of that but you can't have that every evening, can you? It would be too much. It would be asking too much. Usually takes about a minute. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good one, love. Good one. Oh, there we go. It's back. It, it, interestingly it shows it's back online at zero kilobits per second for a few seconds and then it's like oh yeah wait there's some data going here quickly crank it up to 5000 <laughs> there you go we're back please refresh the stream that i really need one of the street decks stream decks this is gonna be my first shortcut <laughs> if you don't see question mark <laughs> there we go all right hopefully they'll be the last time if not well we're used to it here it gives us time to get some water and whatnot so yeah it's it's okay great so it's how did i put it i was listening to that soundtrack you know because i was ready earlier somehow i had a very busy day but somehow i got to be here quite ahead of time so i got everything ready and then i was listening to the soundtrack and i stopped the soundtrack to start the stream and it was like getting into one of those what do you call those like you know the 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 we call it the deaf room you know what i mean with the audio and recording room engineering room i don't know what it's called where you can't hear nothing but your thoughts yeah, that's what it felt okay, like. Okay, so I'm coming. I hope your back is as red as I remember it. Hello, Sister Lupka. Oh, good to see you, Lupka. Hello. How you doing? Ah! That hurts. I fell. I was looking at the screen, checking for a message from my sister. <laughs> He's not the great gamut anymore. I know, I keep doing the same thing. <laughs> but at least, you know, on the computer at least it like pops in and tells you that's not a person. You're typing gibberish. 
<laughs> but I bet you're on the phone now, huh? How's your evening going, Dupka? <laughs> you're gonna play Dead Rising 2 this weekend, Gamut? How far did you guys get? So climb, but don't fall off. Watch where you're climbing. Up, up, up. Or where do you want me to go? I guess up, but not too much up. Whoop. Yep, easy does it. So just keep the bees away for now. There's a lot of bees. It's an infinite swarm. Well, it's time to meet our friend. We can drop this now, I think. Yep. We gotta find a way in. Oh, look, it's a cell phone. Or a satellite phone, I forgot which. Right side, this phone sticks conveniently to your face while you're talking. <laughs> his comments, his comments just spice it up. Let's see, where is that? Scavenger hunt. Beehive shaped like my phone. Ever since I lost my phone in the woods, I have received endless prank calls with nothing but buzzing on the other hand. That's not a bee, that's an actual phone. <laughs> now she gets she has to get used to it. You didn't think about other people's convenience, Gamut. How dare you? All hail the great Pka! <laughs> Gary and I beat it by intent. Wait, you already beat it? What? In one stream? In how many streams? I thought you just started streaming that. If it were me, I'd be streaming that for at least six months. <laughs> you know nothing of this, Dino Gamut. <laughs> Three. Really? Isn't that like a fucking gigantic game? What did you do? Crack up for all night? As Bra would say, crack up on coffee and just like power to the night? Or did you not do everything 100%? I, I played that game a lot and ever, I don't think I got close. I got close to the end. The, the noose was tightening, but I, I would lose interest. Or there would be a hard boss that I'm just set on killing and I'd give up. I know, my mistake, but three streams, man. Three 12 hour streams? Oh, you're here. Oh, so sorry, Lupka. Tylol. Tylol. Tylol hot. Is that like Tylenol? I think that's like our version of Tylenol. So Andol, right? Oh, shit. Is, what it, is it like a flu or what's going on? Whatever it is, get well soon, sis. You did nowhere near 100%. Hello, Bounty Granny. How you doing, Granny? Oh, shit. God, I started talking about the game and my socks and whatnot. I forgot I have friends here. Uh, starting with Mayo Hazard. <laughs> Mayo Hazard will have to start try start streaming earlier. People are getting restless. Wowee. Like Furvix. Yeah, Furvix. That's my... I, w I don't want to say it's my favorite. I want to have any contact with that, but yeah. Three, three, three hour streams. So it is kind of like Majora's Mask at this point. At this point, I mean, it kind of is with uh, repeating uh, three days and all that. So that means you can just like beat the game and don't even level up as much. Because I know you can use the same. What I did was uh, I would restart the story and use the same character. I liked that aspect. Hey, if you suck at the game or just not, you know, just not good at it, that's a nice way of saying sucking at it. <laughs> then you can just. Start again and keep all the levels and shit and just beat the shit out of everything from the start And that that boss that tortured you in the bathroom, you know the one I mean? Yeah, you can just beat the shit out of them. They can't say anything. They'll be like, yeah, blah, 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 I'm a psychopath, blah, blah. But you're already like, uh, down on the floor, bitch. Trash Daddy says hi. Oh, hello, Mr. Trash Daddy. Hello. John, my boy. How's he doing? How are you doing, Bonnie? How are you guys doing? 60 is max. That's a weird number to max the level at. Not 90, not 50, not 99, not 102. <laughs> Donkey Kong, Psychonaut style. Johnny Boo! Let's get in there. Let's see what she has to say for herself. Witch, you don't exist. 
You're just something someone put into my mind. Which means there's probably a very powerful psychic nearby. Another hallucination. A very solid hallucination. Oh man, are you gonna cast a spell or something? Who are you? How did you get in here? And where was our security, eh? Cassio <laughs> Author of Mind Swarm? Awesome. Ford <laughs> brought me through security. Ford? Yeah, she was waiting for him for like 20 years. He came back? Oh, I knew it. I knew he would. But I'm not ready. I've been trying to fix this place up for him, but she's a little. You know, these she snapped a little so off demanding. after all the years. Ford wants me to turn on the astrolabe, but it's covered in, well, really angry bees. Know anything about that? Oh, I think I can help you with that. I'm just happy to be useful again. Get out of my way. Ford needs me. Oh, I can tend to the queen later. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. She says I can't talk to her. <laughs> She's okay. Wait, Cassie. Who's she? Convince Ca Cassie to help. I found the ringleader of the bees inside her house in the in Green Needle Gulch. It's Cassiopeia, one of the original psychonauts. Cassie seems to want to help, but something is preventing her. Hello, Gavin. Welcome to the stream, Gavin. Good morning-ish, Gavin. Wesky, thank you for the raid, sexy Wesky. Oh, sh everything's happening all at once. I'm, I'm ready. I'm still still in my slippers and my bathrobe. <laughs> How you doing, Wesky? What was Wesky playing? Dead by Daylight. How is Wesky serving you today, Wesky? That's a nice welcoming music. Ha. Ha ha. DBD and The Plague. Wait, as The Plague or another game called The Plague? Or is it a little bit of both? Well, thank you for the raid, Wesky. It's so already uh, the entity ordered kill all the survivors, <laughs> and like a good like a good Wesker soldier, you you had to do it. You had to do it. You had no options. Hook was just sitting there, empty, like devoid of all the people screaming on it. So what you gotta do? You put a person on a hook. <laughs> put a person on a hook. It's like that easy when you put it like that. How are the games, my friend? Gavin, how's your day going? <laughs> yes, hookity hook. <laughs> well, good. Did did the uh, who did you say? Did you play Cl the clown and Wesker today, or is it like? Are we waiting for another patch for them to work as intended? <laughs> well, that's great. I'm glad, Wesker. I'm glad. The only plague. The only the puker. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> uh, but it's one of those killers that I always feared, like I said yesterday. Whoo, wow. Been playing Smite on Xbox. Yeah, that game keeps popping up. I know nothing of, of, of it, or really. I just see it pop up here and there. It still didn't get to my retirement home where I spend my days. Returning to live, as in like gold? You mean like going back to gold? <laughs> well, I just started, Wesky. Just started. I'm about to meet another psychonaut, one of the great ones, and lots of bees. There's gonna be bees, but it's gonna be fun. <laughs> I guess I'm supposed to climb or just follow her because we're in the real world now. We got to enter her mind like all of them and rescue her from her own bees. It's all sticky. I'm in a sticky situation here. 
Oh, there they are, the guard bees. I do not want to mess with those bees. What about the other bees? You know, if you sting me, you'll die. I think. Oh, buzz buzz yourself, bees. <laughs> That's her. Anything up there? Yep, so she'll give us the power needed for this. It's a very interesting power. Well, we'll learn it from her, from her mind, basically. So let's get it, let's get inside her head. Cassie, shh, they hear you. Well, that would be, actually, that would be pretty cool. That's a good idea. You know, I know what he's talking about right there. So yeah, they would, it would make, because she kind of, she kind of dresses like the plague. You're completely right. That would be pretty cool since they put in so many Resident Evil characters. I think Mother Miranda deserves a, you know, a nab at it. In the end, she kind of served a better villain than his, than his letter writing royalty, Oswald E. Spencer, more like Oswald E. Ryder, leaving clues everywhere for the Scooby and the gang to find. Get out of here, Spencer. <laughs> that would be that's a good idea, Gavin. Well, I see I see where you're coming from, Whiskey. Yeah, it, it's that it's kinda like that art, but not really. This is like from Tim Schaefer. He used to work for LucasArts, made some legendary games. Some we're gonna stream probably all of his games at some point. I don't know if you played the nineties point and click. Uh, Return to Monkey Island, Secret of the Monkey Island, both of them, yeah, the Monkey Island games, what else, the, the Brutal Legend, the one where there's this rock guy who goes into another universe, still haven't played it, I know about it, I have it for a long time, haven't touched it, you know, that, cre creative games, Spencer can be a legendary skin for Bill, I think Spencer could be his own killer, chasing around in nitro powered umbrella, wheelchair <laughs> just like you're doing a generator he just creeps up from behind you like from here and says just whispers on your ear i am pleased <laughs> just enough that's horror right there <laughs> no he's not an old man he is to be a god <laughs> you know we've been watching x files like i said a few times and um Cancer Man, really, I think Cancer Man was a good inspiration for Spencer. I think there was a lot of X-Files inspiration into Resident Evil mythology, the whole conspiracy and all that. They use a, quite a few of the same elements. I think I've seen Carter, hello, fellow humanoid, and mental issues. <laughs> They're called problems, not issues. <laughs> yeah, Wesky knows what I'm talking about. It's like that, yeah. I was to become a god. <laughs> Insolence! <laughs> what was it? I haven't played Resistance in a long time. I do miss it. Sacrilege! <laughs> oh, they really made him up. They really called. They really called. <laughs> they really made him a Scooby Doo villain. Yeah, a lot of people do that nowadays. Problems just sound like too heavy. If you say issue, it's more. We can work on this issue. Problems like that. Like, Ugh, I don't want to do deal with that. Yeah, in the end. Well, I mean, it wasn't much of a fight for Wesker, was it? He, after everything, after Boulder punching Chris. Well, before Boulder punching Chris, but after Chris quite a few times. Code Veronica, still naive Chris, let's say. Uh, he just goes to fucking Spencer. That's just... If he sneezed at him hard, like, Achoo! That would be done. Spencer's dead. He was that frail. <laughs> Yeah, Wesker is a god. Or whatever left for him, from him, whatever is left for him, you know? She did write the, write the Mind Swarm. We read about that. Cassie, would you sign my copy of Mind Swarm? I was wondering when you were going to ask. It took you so long. Oh, yeah, I don't need that. I need this. Thanks, so, so. Cassie. So, are you the queen? We're gonna raid her head right now. <laughs> Why would you say such a thing? Because you're so pointy, you look in the woods in the dark because you're so tall. Well, pointy, yeah. Because you're so pointy. Those are pine needles. They stick to the honey on my suit. I can't help it. That large pine needles? Because you work. <laughs> you can tell her all three. I do my beekeeping at night because this darn bee suit is so hot. Because you're so tall. Okay, well, I do wear lifts in this thing so I can reach the upper hives, but. 
What beekeeper doesn't do that? So it's the bees that no are doing reason. that? Well, I'll admit, I have been playing into oh, there the you go. a little bit. Why? I need to keep people away from here to protect it. This is a sacred place. What's up with these strange bees? We're gonna sneak things. into her I mind. Lost control of the bees. They're keeping me like a prisoner here. I'm going to help get you out of here, Cassie. The way she's standing. Thanks. What are you doing out here by yourself? Why don't you work out of the mother room with the rest of the psychonauts? Oh, I never could adapt to the whole new psychonauts thing. I like to stay out here and remember the old days. Also, I want to take care of it as best I can, in case Ford and the others ever come back. She never fit in. Would you mind if I snuck a peek inside your mind? Oh, thank you. I haven't had a chance. <laughs> She's so away. relaxed with it. Yeah, just fucking go inside my head. Yeah, it'll be fine. Just knock yourself out. <laughs> That's the most positive answer to that we've had. Along with all the Thorny Towers residents. Hello? Cassie? Bees? Here we go. I mean, people mostly at least question Cassie. that, you know? I... It's okay, I know why you're here. So we're gonna learn her past and what now, painful to burden she shall I dedicate wears. this inscription? Not that many people find their way in here these days. You must have a good head on your shoulders. Uh, definitely a big one. Now, just imagine what you could do if you were using 175% of your brain. Actually, Cassie, I need your help with something else. We're on a critical mission. But there's a swarm of bees that's making it impossible. Stop right there, young man. Nothing <laughs> is impossible if you follow the 25 simple steps I've outlined in my book. Now then, let's go show these bees what we can do when we put our minds together. I'm a fish. Look at my bones. There's that pesky little volume. Thank you, young man. I have been looking for this silly book forever. Wait, she was going to help me. What? This one? <laughs> oh, I'll admit the author was helpful once when we needed the money to leave the country. This is important. But that was a long time ago. But when the chips were down and we needed to fight to protect our friends, ah, worthless. Is there another Cassie book in there that could help me? They are all restricted. Hmm. Then again. Maybe I could help you, if you were to help me. There are two other books missing from my collection. Dangerous books. <laughs> These are the books that got us into this horrible situation. These are the wrong books, you understand? Round them up for me. Take them out of circulation. They are overdue. Understand? Then you'll help me with the bees? I'll help you with the whole alphabet, Sonny. Oh, I hear, I hear. I already hear emotional baggage. So close. So we gotta sort the library, so to speak. This will take us further, but before we go... Oh, there's a lot of shit here. I remember her mind is so cluttered. Or someone who's so organized. Which, you know, is the whole point showing us that, but man. That looks like a bird or something. Can we talk, lady? Hello? Shh. Lower your voice, please. <laughs> Where should I look for the missing books? Maybe you should start at the beginning. Have you tried the children's corner? Wesky, do you play uh, do you play platformers? I I've, I've seen you play some old school platformers like The Lion King and what else? Sonic the Hedgehog, stuff like that. But I don't think I've ever seen you play a 3D platformer, something like Banjo Kazooie or Crash Bandicoot. 
What else do we have? Those are all the 3D platformers. Bubsy 3D. <laughs> what books am I looking for exactly? One is supposed to be a teacher's edition textbook. But I doubt there are any valuable lessons in there. The other is a lurid crime story. Ugh, terrible books. The sooner we get them in isolation, the better. The books are the books are basically her past. Doot, 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 doot. Oh. What books? What books am I looking for exactly? One is supposed to be. Oh, you can ask her again. Textbook. But I doubt there are any valuable Skip. lessons in there. Can I talk to that nice writer, Cassie, again? You don't want to talk to her. She seems harmless, but she's full of dangerous ideas about human potential. How dare she? Why do you want to round up these books? Because I'm the only one around here who cares about safety. I care. Great. The other Cassies had their chance to run things, and everybody got hurt. How did everybody get hurt? We all went to fight in the river. And guess which motivational speaker thought she could talk sense into that monster? Ridiculous! We just made her mad, made things worse. So now, I'm in charge, and I keep all the books in order. All the important books. <laughs> no offense. But I think you're running too tight a ship here. You can't keep people prisoner. Better to lock up a few books than have the entire library destroyed. Radical. I gotta run. No running in the library. What? This librarian aspect of Cassie's mind seems to have her whole psyche on lockdown. Yep. Until I figure out a plan, I'll play along with her scheme to avoid suspicion. There you go, smart thinking. What can we put there? Rainbows is good, so yeah, I did get the rainbow punches. I love it, but it's kind of just visual, and I'm gonna put something useful in there. But it's pretty good if you want to add more color to the already colorful <laughs> sensorium, psyching sensorium. Then yeah, it would just like color overload. Time bubble. No, what else was I gonna put there? Goonades, yeah. I love that one because they explode once you burn them. Oof. What is this? Looks like a turkey thing? What are you? Hey, can you help me find these books? What? I'm her favorite assistant and best assistant, and I already looked, so give it up. Favorite and best, and I already looked. Someone's got a <laughs> takeover issue. I think we're gonna go everywhere in the end, so I shouldn't I shouldn't bother too much. Oh look, there's a there's a nugget I think, or half a mine, Eat whichever. They're both good. Excellent. Oh, there's one down there. Ah! Do I have the time bubble? Bible. Time Bible. No, too late. Alright. But basically it's that. Oop. Come on, zip. Swip it zip. Oh you can slow down. I like that you can slow down the figments and actually see see them sucked in. Ah! Ooh. Should have expected that. So we have these around. There's three of them, right? Yo, that one opens that door. Oh, look, there's one here. That door. You got half a mine there. The purse that's crying. Nope. Can you go up? Can you please go up? Hop. 
There we go. Where's the half of mine thingy over there? Can't get there from here. So I guess climb the same thing. I remember the, the route here. I know there's a route. It's these ropes, at least for starters. Ah, you gotta use the time bubble. The bad thing is you can get them out of sync and it gets very hard to get them. Zoop, zoop. Oh, there's more there. I hope that one doesn't go in. There you go. And there's one below. Can we do it from here? Like, like this? No. All oh, right, that worked. This is gonna move later, I remember. Mm. Yeah, the whole thing is rocking. Can I slow it down? Nope. Oh. Nope. That's how. Super jump. Some more here. Zoop, zoop, zoop. There's Cassie there. Uh, please don't go in. I don't have a tag yet, do I? Wait, what's making missing in the tomb? One figment? One fi- oh, don't you just love it when one figment is missing? No wait, it's not the figment, it's something else. Oh, it's the memory vault, that's okay, we couldn't have had it, I think. I think the whole point is it's missing at the start. It's supposed to be missing at the start, so you wouldn't find out, you know, everything. There's one more on the other side. This thing looks like the purse baggage. Oh, could have you can use that, nice. I think that's a ball that's all oh look there's a lady going in and out. No wait, where is that? It is some kind of a juggler. Can't tell if that's a dress or yeah, oh, she's juggling something, all right. All right, let's start by pulling this cord. So this is children's corner, and the other one, literature lane. Which one did she say? The thing you can always ask her. <laughs> What books am I looking for exactly? One is supposed to be a teacher's edition textbook, but I doubt there are any. Oh, that's the that's the one for kids. The other is a lurid crime story. Ugh, terrible books. The sooner we get them in isolation, the better. All right. I gotta run. No running in the library. So let's go children's corner first. I bet it's gonna be easier. That's how you open those, right? But we can't do it with the telekinesis from this side. Hey, you're not a child. No. <laughs> no. Well, this shouldn't take too long. Is there a new enemy under the app? You're gonna have a new... Enabler, support negative thoughts. Oh God, yeah, that's their, basically their mage. It's cheering Seriously? them on. <laughs> All right, we gotta get the enabler first. The enablers are no good. They're under that enabler's protection. Uh, gotta remember the time bubble. Just a little bit more. Oh shit! How did it fuck you? Oh. Up 
Now nah, you're a fucking boy. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, they're all back. Alright, we'll be able to talk to them, I think. Man, I, uh, again, it's so fresh in my memory. I don't know why, but it's been over two years now. Finished this, what, early September 2021. It's still like it was yesterday. Hey, have you seen any runaway books? Uh, sorry, smart ain't my thing. What is he supposed to be? Let's get some clairvoyance. What do they see me as? Paperboy. Wait, what about her? Ah, oh, damn. When we're back, I didn't check what the librarian sees with it. This is gonna be health. If it's shining green, it's got health in it. Good amount of health. Hi. Memento mori. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Is this from? Is this something about Grim Fandango? That's another Tim Schafer game. Oh shit! I'm a tombstone with goggles. All right. At least I'm a I'm a fashionable tombstone. And notice, like, everything flips when you change direction, but the tombstone doesn't, I guess, so it wouldn't say on it, peer. Yeah, remember your mortality. Having fun? Getting pretty sore, actually. This thing doesn't even have a saddle. <laughs> <laughs> I look like a paper kid, all right. Also, paper kid. Wait, I didn't talk to her. Hi, I'm Raz. And I am the Lady of the Lake. Helper of knights on noble missions. Ooh, I'm on a noble mission. Can you help me? Sorry. Already gave my sword to a handsome knight fighting a dragon. Mmm, yeah, that's right. That's uh, something little on a... Uh, on the boar. Hey, have you seen any... Why did we books? turn like that? Uh, Sorry, smart ain't my thing. What'd you turn? He turned that way. So we can't go back that way now. We gotta keep on climbing. Use the time bubble a lot. Thank you, Jack Black. Oh, I didn't want to do both of them, but what can we do? That somehow worked. Can I climb this? Oh, you can. You can climb the... What do you call this in English, even? Yep. <laughs> the need? No, that's not the needle point. It's the other thing. What's the axe for? Bookworms. They ate my family. Damn. <laughs> All right. No, don't slow him down. I'm gonna have to change something here. Let's put. Let's put Claire Royans there for now. Still a paper boy. All right. <laughs> That's it for now. They ate my family. Anything up there? I don't think so, right? Hi, what's your name? Guten Tag, ich bin Gerda. The Pretzelmeister's daughter. Oh, where's the Pretzelmeister? Papa fell into the Pretzel machine. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Brothers Grim, Don't much? Worry. It was his secret wish. Really? I think so. That's why I pushed him. God. <laughs> now growing up on Disney versions of uh, Tom. Well, not that wasn't Disney. That was just a musical with. Uh, what's her face? P -p 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 she's fish. Damn, I forgot her name. A very good jazz singer from the 40s and 50s. They had a musical movie with her name. Yeah. It does sound pretty spot on. Um, so yeah, Tom Tom, then Disney's versions of Peter Pan and I don't know. Sleeping Beauty. Cinderella is a big one. We watched Cinderella about a hundred times, didn't we, Luca? We had that on videotape. 
But then years later, years later, so I was already a big boy of eight, nine years old. <laughs> I read the actual fairy tale. I was like, holy fucking shit. Why did the pigeons eat the sister's eyes out? And like, there's so many gruesome details. But it makes for a little more interesting fairy tale. I'm not gonna lie. Go there. Oh, there's another one. The cat. A lot of them like are the, like Tom Thumb. He ends up in a cow's. He has to go inside a dead cow's uh, stomach to survive the night. They don't show you that in the movie. It's like Timothy Dalton as a villain, smoking a big hookah or whatever. Oh, there we go. We did miss one. I'm gonna have to go up there somehow. There was a shame to leave that one. <laughs> like, you probably know what I'm gonna say, but I did watch the movie <laughs> with Bruce Willis. And I think there was a book as well, wasn't there? There we go. Let's get the book. Oh yeah, we're gonna go through the books. I remember this. I don't remember being in this book. Concilium apum. The concilium of bees. Concilium of bees. Oh wait, those are those are figments. There's one more up there. How the fuck do I even get there? Aha, uh -huh, maybe like this. Can't use the powers. Oh wait, maybe from the other page. Yeah, I think so. Olim Vespa Dixit Alvarium Edat V6, maybe? Apis Fortis Inci Incipiunt. Bombilare Olim Vespa Dixit Alvarium Edam V Apis Fortis. Wait, it's just Lupin, isn't it? I see Vespa. That's, that's, a, that's a wasp. No, 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 don't fall. All right, we do it again. All right, let's try to do it this time. Hiya! Don't fall. Oh, there you go. That's what I want. Alvarium. Is that like... The hive? Vespa, 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 Vespa. Vespa, Vespa. Vespa, Vespa. Oop. Vespa Fortes. Alright, uh, whatever, like, if we stay along with Latin, I'm gonna try to start veering towards Spanish. <laughs> I had watched the TV show with the intention to hate it. At least you're honest, what can I tell you? Carter. But it was too good, like, really good. Not as batshit crazy as the movie, but well, well thought through. Yeah, we'll get back to that. The woke woke time travel plot the with we oh you probably mean whole <laughs> the woke time travel plot the whole time travel plot of four seasons was already completely written out as they started filming the first that's pretty good so they didn't have to like bullshit too much huh or at all yeah i had some issues i love the movie but i have some issues with it oh love we're close I think we're actually here. Uh, Sash? No, we're not. We're close. Oh, there it is. We're here. Nice. Well, thanks for the recommendation, man. You're just like too many of them <laughs> and too little time. Gotta watch out. But I gotta giant... see that. Uh, you out there hunting for you. Don't worry, young man. The librarian can't get in here. That's why she sends in her operatives. Who, me? I'm not an operative. I'm just playing along with her until I find the real Cassie. The real Cassie? Tell me, child, what is your name? Rasputin. And tell me, who is the real Rasputin? The uh -huh. one you are with your friends? With your family? Or the one you save for your special someone? Hmm? Is that the real you? 
Or are you actually a combination of all those different identities? Important challenges in our lives can cause us to create entirely new identities for ourselves, sometimes summoning powerful archetypes from our unconscious mind. The hero, the explorer, the shadow. My special talent allows me to summon up whatever archetype I yep. need to survive my current situation. Would you like me to teach you how? Yes, there we go. Focus your mind's eye on a vision of the archetype you need most right now. Is it a trickster? A wise mentor? Or maybe a mighty warrior? Close your eyes. Empty your thoughts. Just focus on the most powerful... Oh, she's hypnotizing me now. ...most helpful identity you can. You're going to need help if you're going to face that librarian. Here we go. Projection. We're gonna project now. Summon an archetype to distract enemies and help with puzzles. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, well, very good. You'll get better with practice. There you go. He learned. That's the final power in this game. <laughs> From Cassiopeia herself. <laughs> Your archetype will act on its own sometimes, but you can also focus it on a specific task. All right. So focus on the door. I think if I use projection on this door, my archetype would go in there. But how? Oh, that's hey. it. <laughs> Are you ready, love? Here we go. Hi. I'm a fish. Look at my bones. <laughs> it's too adorable. It's too adorable. Just like there for the sake of being adorable. Hi. I'm a fish. Look at my bones. <laughs> Just that voice. It's too cute. Good dog. Skeleton dog. Some really creepy thoughts in here, huh? Except for the fish. The fish is amazing. More! More! Here we go. Hi. I'm a fish! Look at my bones! <laughs> Gotta love it. Ah, I wonder if the... You know, I don't put, like, copyrighted stuff as uh, sound effects. I would love to put that as a sound effect Hi. for Sasha. I'm a fish! Look at my bones! It's just like... <laughs> be able to summon it, whatever. Ah. Look at my bowl. <laughs> Let me see just what Carter wrote there. Have a batshit crazy character talks in pop culture references. Oh, is there? You already bought me, man. You can stop. Inspirational speech she would, should give. <laughs> and uh, she should give. And it's completely filled with movie quotes. She ends the speech with be excellent to each other. Uh, now you gotta rewatch it too, huh? Caboose. Good to see you, buddy. <laughs> That's pretty good. I didn't know there was a show. Did you say it was a German show? Yeah. Like I said, I don't put... I don't purpose. I don't put anything copyrighted in here. If, like, even Pistol Pack and Mama, I made sure it's in public domain. I guess we could put Mickey Mouse now. But I'll look into that. I don't know. I don't know, honestly. I would love to. That would be a great... Hi. I'm a fish. Look at my bones. Sound effect. Now, before we get sick of it, let's get in here. So use the projection. Where did I put it? RB. <laughs> That's the spirit. What a good boy. See where this little fellow takes you. I'll meet you at the end. And there we then go. I'll tell you my plan for the librarian. <laughs> okay, Lubka. <laughs> she's ah, oh, she's riled up now. <laughs> 
Oh, here we go. That sounds like a South Park character moment. Sup, clone? Aw, that's cute. My clone thinks he's real. <laughs> Hi there. Lob dub. What was that? Lob dub. Lob dub. Lob dub. Uh. Lob. <laughs> hey, I know you. Aren't you from The Mine and Introduction? Yes, yes. Always nice to meet a fan. No time for autographs, though. Sorry. Wow. Conceited. Please <laughs> excuse me. I have a lot of thinking to do. <sighs> Dinosaur. The <that's> sign. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. I gotta see that show, man. I had no idea it exists. Like I said, I like the movie. I have some issues with it. Like, I don't mind the dark ending. So, uh, dark ending can make things better, but it just feels like a lot of shit was skipped at some points. Dum, dum, dum. Why so glum, Dino Chum? Well, I'm from an old textbook, and it turns out I'm not considered a real dinosaur anymore. Please don't tell the librarian. She'll throw my whole book out. You're not considered a dinosaur anymore? What is it considered? It looks like a chicken to me. They all look like chickens. And that's why we need this power to finish some of the brains. Don't 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 fall asleep on me. Oh, look at him go. So cute. Why do I have to do all the hard work? Back in the chip. I used to be a writer, but then I got a pen in the knee. <laughs> Don't oh. you just love books? Yes, <laughs> they're delicious. Hey, maybe you should try reading books instead of eating. Read books? What is that, some no fad diet? Oy. Sounds like a good way to start to death. Oh, they're, they're literally bookworms. Excuse me? Yes? Are you in pain? To be free of the flesh is to be free of pain, my child. How did you lose your skin? I donated my body to medical science. I had no idea this is what they had in mind. Yikes. Are you mad about it? Skin's actually a lot more trouble than it's worth, to be honest. Uh... I have rashes, itching, pimples. Aren't you cold? Cold is a feeling of the flesh, my friend. No skin, no cold. Wait, what about, like, internal... We have, I'm pretty sure we have thermos, thermoception in, on in, the inside as well, right? You look like you could teach me a lot about anatomy. You bet. How's this for starters? There's one of me inside of you. Gross. Hey, that's insensitive. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> they went there. I th I thought you were using that as a as a as a you know as a metaphor. You know, like an old man going. <laughs> I honestly, all this time, because you mentioned before, all this time for over a year, I thought you you were like doing it like. Argh. My sh hand is shaking in anger. Are are you serious? So. What's the cause of that? How does that even work? Is it like blood sugar? Is it... Well, there you go. That's why you gotta ask questions, even if it's something seems natural. You gotta ask questions. Always ask questions. When someone says that's a dumb question, tell them no, there are no dumb questions. Just dumb people not believing in questions. <laughs> why aren't you like dripping blood and stuff? It happens from time to time, but I just go over to the horror books and drip on them. They like it. Bye, muscle man. Bye, baggy old clothes boy. Peggy old clothes boy. <laughs> it's like a, that's a book tree. So there's nothing up here. I guess we could go out. All right, my boy. Wait, where is he? Oh, he got, he was undrawn. He disappears after a while. <laughs> Get out of there, you sick. Like a pesky bill. I love him. Like he's got a uh, so close to the end of the game we get another character with its own banter. 
<laughs> I, <laughs> it's Lyubka, it's like when someone says, try to relax. Where was it? Have, have you ever tried to relax? <laughs> it's a paradox. Yeah, I remember you told me about the job, but man, what the hell happened? Uh, sounds like PTSD more than anything. Oh, gee, oh, no. crap. Can he do anything, really? I think he can do. Let's leave him to his... Let's kill this little shit bastard. Don't let him... They gotta kill the healer. Yeah, both of them. Oh, he's switched. There you go. All right. Yeah, I can send them to enemies. That's right. Leave my ah. Oh. You killed them. You killed my archetype. Your brave archetype will distract enemies and drop their fire. Yeah, he just did that. It didn't end well. Oh, I won me one of those. All right. Now you made me mad. Come on, spit it. Spit it out, boy. All right, that works too. Why not? Come on, spit it. Spit it out. Just one down. You can't protect all of them. Oh, they can kill each other. So just... I guess you just focus on one of them. That's what I want. Yeah, all right. So catch one of them. Which one do I want to catch? Let's slow him down a little. Whoop. Catch the bulb. Throw the bulb. That easy. Will you die, please? I guess. I'm gonna say he's weaker to fists than to anything else. I mean, I can do this till tomorrow. Oh shit, didn't mean to do that. The time bubble is the king. So like, high excitement? Let's talk, let's, let's go around the room and talk to everyone. What are you a molecule for? I don't know. What are you a person for? <laughs> hey, are you the formula for a general conical surface? No, I just clenched my belt too tight. Hard to breathe. <laughs> Wait, uh, I do want... I do want to see what kind of crazy shit am I... Oh, wait, what does my archetype see me as? Tell me what you see, boy. Oh, he sees himself. Alright, I'm sending you to the hereafter until further need. You sure you wanna do that? How, how do I cancel him? Uh, oh, you don't need to use them. Alright. I wanna put uh, time bubble and... Well, you know what? Leave it. Like, Nope. I know what. Why? Because I wanted to have this. They just turn off the power. All right, that's how. Hi, what are you two up to? Psh, we're running away from our spouses to start a new life together. Hmm. Wait, that's a geek joke. I'm trying to get it. Oh, look, I look like a. What do you call that in English? A conus? A cone? And it's actually the. <laughs> Hold the formulas. No, I'm done with maths for this life. <laughs> Quit it. The bike doesn't talk. What about you? You don't bite people, do you? Only if their name is Ferris. Huh? Sorry, magnet humor. Yep, geek humor. There you go. What about you, sine wave? What are you a formula for? S sine waves. <laughs> Yeah, that like if may you might remember this these from school or if you're an in, if you're an engineer then you know you maybe remember them from earlier this afternoon. Hey there. Hello. 
I'm missing a piece. Can you calculate its volume? No. Kids today. Well, you could actually, right? They've given us all the measurements. So since the, the, the down surface is uh, the right piece of a right circle, that would be like literally what? The area of a piece of a circle. 2RP? But then you, you also got to know the other end and how much is missing. And then multiply that by the height, which is in this case D. But it's not a right angle. It's again, it's circular. So I know there's a lot of P's in there. <laughs> oh, there's a... All right, there's a couple of things here, actually. Wow, there's quite a few things. Let's start with over there that seems less likely to be the way forward. Interestingly, the last figment you pick up is the symbol for figments. We can go there. Can we go there? It kind of looks like we can, but then again, not really. Maybe, maybe that's the thing. After we do everything, we end up there, huh? Oh, there you go. We can climb here and then here. Chessboard. I think I hear something. Well, here we go. There's the knight with the dragon that the Lady of the Lake talked about. Hey, you two. Not a good time. Nice sword. It was bequeathed to me by the fair Lady of the Lake so that I may slay this dragon. What did I ever do to you? What are you guys fighting about? No idea. I was just chilling when the Crusader here got all aggro on me. Let those be thy last words, worm from hell! Hey, can I borrow that sword? Yes, please take it. Nay, for tis my duty most holy to embed its steel into this deadly beast. See? What normal person talks that way? <laughs> Is there a way we could maybe de-escalate this situation? This guy and his horse are just straight up jerks. <laughs> I agree, Silverwind. Dragons are a plague on our land. Mr. Knight? That's Sir Knight to you. Sir Knight? Maybe you should just leave that dragon alone? Have you allied yourself with the devil's winged serpent? Hey, kid, don't worry about it. I already called the cops. <laughs> I'm just keeping this weirdo occupied until they get here. Summon whatever reinforcements you wish. We'll need them to haul your stinking carcass away. <laughs> okay, buddy. <laughs> that reminds me of the end, the ending of uh, Monty Python, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, <laughs> when after all that medieval adventure, just like it's it's. <laughs> hey, if you know, if you know, no, if you don't want it spoiled, cover your ears. But like for a 50, 60 year old movie. But uh, <laughs> just police comes in there like, all right, you weirdos, everybody in the van, enough of this, and just packs all the knights and <laughs> Sir Arthur and all of them into a police van and just takes them away. Like, what the fuck did I just see here? <laughs> Maybe we should focus on what you two have in common. Like, do you guys like pizza? Oh yeah. Me, me too. Well, that's amazing. I had no idea dragons liked pizza. Great. What are your favorite flavors? Pepperoni. I usually get half and half. On one side, I like pineapple and ham, and on the other side, I like maidens and cheese. Oh, my God. Pineapple and ham is an abomination. <laughs> I knew you were a fell beast. Will you two be okay if I leave? Yeah, don't worry. This guy's all talk. I am merely finishing up my pre-smoting prayers. Whatever. Pre-smoting prayer. Pre yep, these guys are an emotional baggage. Paper kid? Alright, what about you? What about baggage? I never tried like what is the ba oh, talk to happened. baggage. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. Oh. Like a, a bellboy? 
I need the purse tag here. Oh, we don't have a purse tag. All right, fair enough. We don't have a purse tag yet. Back it up, boys. So we'll get there once we get the purse tag. What's that sound? It's still the same thing from before. Alright, that's all in this room, right? We can go ahead. We can chill on ahead. That's a lot of beef. Oh, there you go. It was right there. Alright, we'll go bring it to the owner. I've seen it before there, but I didn't want to go there. Didn't think of uh, the actual baggage being here. I like the animation for sorting the emotional baggage in this game a lot more than in the first one. Of course, it's a big improvement. But in the first one, they always do the same thing and it kind of lasts forever. After you've seen it five times, that's enough. And they reuse the same music and everything, but they tightened, they made the animation different for every type of uh, emotional baggage. And, you, you know, they're much faster, they're snappier. Can I do it now? Yeah, I can do it. Ah, oh, I have to have him hold it. All right. I need you here, buddy. Wait, I have enough to level something up, including that, right? Maddie pal. Your archetype has a healing presence that slowly restores your mental energy. Yeah. I hope my improved projection abilities don't go to my archetype's head. <laughs> when your archetype is active, his healing presence will slowly restore your mental energy. Keep him around to support you during battles. Now that's the difference. Then two ply. Your archetype can take twice as much damage. That's gonna be cool. <laughs> two ply paper, huh? Paper cuts. Enemies take damage when they melee attack your archetype. Yeah, those are all very useful. It's got useful power. I just gotta yeah, I have it built. Yep. Zip. And hold it. How do I tell him to hold it? My dogs are barking today. I would not go in there if I were you. These things are murder on my back. So how do I make him hold it? I forgot. Or is he just like slow down? Oh, well, let's try a combination with I'm the time bubble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do de do. Do de do. I thought he could hold it or something, or maybe, maybe the thing is to have him. Wait, let me try something. Hey, what's that over there? Another day, another dollar. Let me try. Nope, you gotta let it go. Huh? Interesting. All right. Here I go. Here I go. I like the this voice. The voice gets slower with it. All right, that's the that's the other book. This is also a large level, obviously. Primus. Primus what? Uh, Apis. Oh, it's like her test textbook. Yeah, very interesting concepts. I love this. Should they do the right thing? I think I did. Whee! <laughs> what the? Oh no, not him! Oh gee, oh gee, Rick! Alright, now it's gonna be easy. Oh, Ooh, it hurts. They have power-ups, it seems. Catch it? No, wait, I don't have that power on. Oh, shit. I forget. So, archetype and... Yes, it's tele telekinesis. Now I gotta combine more powers. So, I'm gonna say... Uh, grabby, grabby. That's okay. Wow, one-hit shot, huh?
Why are they exploding all of a sudden? That's not the grab power. Ouch. Fucking regrets, get away from me. I don't want to regret shit. Ow. Whoa, they're carrying nukes now. They're not fucking around. Oh, there's more of them. Why are you killing my guy? Oh, I forget I have a charge shot. You killed him again. And there's a memory vault. At least I didn't die for nothing. Come back here. I don't have telekinesis to chase you around. Ah, oh, you little... I even forgot where is tele... Levitation. Levitation, that's what I mean. That's... that's. I was just testing you. Cassie's escape plan. Oh, we're gonna learn about this. It's gonna be one section of the level, actually. It's a big level, like I said. Like, uh, like Psy King Sensoria, one of the big ones. She was printing money, apparently. There's a printing press and... Her boss is a giant Chinese woman dressed in... Is that a bling and knives? What the hell? Why is she... Oh, and guns? All right, she's ready for war, I guess. And she's printing money. Not a criminal at all. Cassie was taken away. Uh, arrested. They put her on polygraph. She was sweating it out. Everyone was looking at her. Snitch? Is that the snitch part? She wrote something, a book, I guess. Printed it. Yep, she wrote the book, printed it. Self-published it. The Mind Swarm. Potential name for tonight's episode. Didn't use it after all. We went with Queen B. Sasha, you were right. I should have just called it Queen B without the... I was like, but Queen B just sounds like... Wrong thing. I forgot about the librarian. It would have been fitting. So we're going to rename it retroactively. You know what? We're going to rename it current actively. It just hit me. Mind Swarm. Her book. People are lining up to buy it. It's quite, quite a bright title in that murky world. She got a ton of cash. She handed in a ton of cash. Wow, that's a big pile of money to get a boat ticket. I guess inflation was... Hard in China in the 60s. This is 60s, right? Yeah, before she met everyone. Before she met Compton Bull and... Oh, that's that's up. We were here. We were here. No, wait. This is the boat still. This is the boat. She's going away. She's saying farewell. She's already a rich lady. Here you go, love. I was wrong and you were right. Ta-da! Successfully updated. Yeah, that's I rarely do that. Update shit on the fly. But here you go, love. The title has been updated. Alright, so... Why did my guy die here? Please heal me. Thank you, guy. So what else is in here? How did I end up here... I read the book, that's right, and I and I I came here from a book. Alright, grandpa. Oh, they're gonna close, are they? Yep. I think time bubble will help. Whoa. Oh shit! I was hoping I would avoid it. I've been too deep. Alright, I need the last one, so let's try to do it right this time. A little lower. Yeah, both of them. Cadmium? Two... the... two... T-U-V-W? Two... oh, what did you... Did you see that? Oh, wait, shit, I can do that? No, oh, wait, there's more. I guess you gotta have the, this active to even have it as an option. Mental connection. There we go. 
That's the second nugget already? Wait, where did they come from? Where can I go? I guess I can go just there. What about... Oh, wait, there's something. There's a tag down there. I'm going down there. Watch me go there, Steve. Do I have... Yeah, I have everything I need. Geronimo! Oh! Up. I still kept thinking it's a half mine. Even though I just said it's a... It's a tag. Suitcase. Do we see the suitcase? It's the pink bag. Oh, didn't do it right. Oops. Oh, there, there was just the alphabet, eh? That's Cassie. Anything else left up here? I don't think so. Oh, wait, there is. There is. Totally missed that. Alright, I gotta go back. Sorry, Cassie. But how? How am I supposed to get there? I guess go up? No, I can't go up from here. I was up already. Alright. We'll find a way. Hiya! Didn't work as intended, but you know, it did something. Let me get over there. I might have an idea. Oh, no! That's not. That's definitely not the idea I had. Hello, Delmar. Hello. Yeah, we had a we had a we had a, a big hype train yesterday. Joe, I don't know. Maybe Joe's watching and working. You got a thanks, Joseph, my boy. Ah, shit, my legs. Wait, where's my archetype? Who's healing me? Nobody? I don't need the shooty-shooty now, so... Let's put him there. I need more help from you, buddy. How you doing, Delmar? I gotta get down there. It's eating me. I think you just drop from here, right? There's no nothing else left here. But that one thing... Where is it? Oh, there it is. Thank you, my boy. Now we go up. He's gonna drop a health point every few seconds. We're doing good. We're doing good. Uh, We're just tired working a lot, but we're getting there. You know, there's a, there's enough work. We're happy, and we just wish we had more energy. You know, to like do it all now and fuck it. Don't have to do it every day. But we're doing great, man. Glad to hear you're doing good as well. There is something about it, yeah. Though I do like rarely, you know, that they did did a mix of modern 3D and cell shaded. In a way, so it's not fully cell shaded, obviously. It kind of looks cartoony, but not fully. Except some things. It's a good mix of art. It's the same theme that worked on it. Yeah, yeah, it does. Sadly, you know, you gotta, you always gotta, whatever you're doing, you gotta sacrifice one thing to make another thing happen. You just gotta, you have to be careful with things, you know, you choose. That's the only thing I would, I guess I would say about that. Thank you for the heels, my boy. Dude, you do yourself. It. He helped. Seeing you two work together so well really inspired me. And it gave me an idea. We need to get all of Cassie's archetypes together, round up all the runaway books, and give them to the librarian. But she'll lock you all up. Oh, don't worry. We won't be in them. We'll be with you. Uh -huh. Now, go find the others. Hurry! No, that's so trippy good. Oh, I like the that. Teacher's edition. We all learned so much from this one, but we can't have her making up new identities and confusing things right when I'm getting everything sorted. Can we? No, we can't. Huh. Just one more book to go. You're right on the edge of becoming my favorite assistant. 
The battle with Maligula must have brought this librarian to power. There it is. To make Cassie feel safe, I think I should help Cassie get her aspects back in balance. Can you talk to her? Hello? Shh. Lower your voice, please. I found a book. Now please help me with the bees. Sorry, kid. We librarians are an all-or-nothing breed. Now get me that other book. Any idea where the second say? book is? My spies have seen traces of that filthy book in literature lane of all places. <laughs> we tore the place apart. Still, nothing. We know I that. Gotta run. No running in the library. She gonna she gonna be jealous? Hey, can you help me find these books? I'm her favorite assistant oh, no. and best assistant, and I already looked, so give it up. So give it up. Give it up, old chap. Yep. All right, suitcase, you're gonna get sorted. Calm down. Calm your zippers. There you go. Ah. <laughs> the doofy face. Yeah, there's more above. We're gonna. Yeah. We're not nearly close to the end. I wonder. I just gotta do it because it's because I'm me. Hello. What's that? What's the other book I'm looking for? A lowly story of crime ha, and that. corruption. Try not to touch it with your bare hands. I gotta run. No so, running in the library. They so they uh she changes the lines. They don't repeat between uh, sections. That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, what? Wait, really? That's the that's the reason. <laughs> Hiding behind your counter. Uh, I probably need the archetype here. Zdravo Maiko, zdravo dobroveče, zdravo Maiko, zdravo oče. Hello, mother and father of hippie. Šta se radi, Maiko? Oh wait, first gotta call him. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, you can borrow this. Hey! What's that? Sure, sure. You can't take it easy, big guy. Oh wait, that's something else. That's not what I thought it was. It's this. Oh, great. Let's go there. So we gotta find the switch for that gate. How did they climb up there after all these... Oh, that's right. Gotta... Gotta... Climb the drawers. Where do I start? It's gonna be plainly obvious once I see it. But before seeing it, it's not gonna be so obvious. Oh, yeah. It's over there. Deal with this so my boss doesn't have to. Uh, my archetype is having the time of his life. Oh no, that's the one you gotta stop. Man, I mixed him up! There goes my leg. Where's the airplane? Give me more. Oh, you got more health for me? I guess it's it's on a timer. It really sounds like a South Park character. Oh, god damn it! So they're both fast. All right, let's keep it. Let's pay attention this time before doing anything. You know that usually helps with platforming games. Both. Cause they stay open for like a second. This one closes as well, but it closes differently. See what I mean? So if I do it right, I should be able to send him now. Where is it? I gotta send them over there. There it is. Go, go forth, my minion. Is that a penny over there? 
He's gonna pull it now. And that takes us up. Er, upper. Oh, did I just rank up? And there's a Ford Crawler with a bacon. Wow, Ford. You look so young. Ah, uh, yes. I was brilliant back in the day. But now I'm a little, um, all over the place. But I'm <laughs> sure if Cassie keeps tending her beehives, I'll come back to my old self someday. So that's what she thinks. That's what she thinks, and she's she's devastated that they went the other direction. It's like the band split up, there's Compton Bull. She felt useless after they moved to the mother load. Agent Bull? Hello, little boy. Can you help me get into the literature wing? I wish I could, but the way through is blocked in a most confusing manner. I do get so overwhelmed without Cassie here to help me. She's so good at multitasking, you know. She's my best friend. Why isn't she helping you? I don't know. Where is she? We do actually. We have Harold the Rat. Um, who else do we have? There's quite a few. Um, most of the wild wildlife you can talk to, well, you can communicate with. You can pet them. With telekinesis, if you put uh, where is it, beast mastery uh, pin, so it modifies your telekinesis instead of crushing, killing squirrels and shit, you pet them. Um, we had more. We have <laughs> we have Raz's baby brother. We have his granny. Well, well, big reveal. Cover your ears, but it was in the next. Uh, it was in the last episode. So Maligula, Maligula, the big bad thing we're chasing here the big bad witch is actually is actually Rasputin's real grandmother so after the battle uh, Ford kind of tricked them all well no actually sorry I got the wrong uh, Raz's real grandmother and grandfather drowned in the in the in the deluge that his great aunt so his grandmother's sister, Lucy, that we know as a Maligula, created. Now I'm saying all this because the granny herself is a she's adorable. She's such a cute granny. But you know, they locked away her a very dangerous side side of the, her psyche. She's adorable. I know she's not a turtle, but still. <laughs> Hi Otto. Any idea where the missing books are? Nope. No idea. Isn't that ridiculous? I think I'm so smart, even though I can't figure out some of the simplest things. <laughs> that's so. That's what Cassie. That's how Cassie sees her friends, in her mind. There's Helmut. Still voiced by Jack Black. Hi, Helmut. And a grand huzzah to you, fine lad. Isn't it a lovely day today? A feast for the senses. Uh, yeah. Except, well, Cassie's acting a little strange, don't you think? Strange acting, you say? Well, not everyone is as well-trained in acting as I am, so best not to judge. Ah, uh, never mind. It's always tempting to look for a dark spot when the sun is shining, young lad. <laughs> but why not enjoy the sunshine instead? Well, that's a good advice, actually. And Bob! Excuse me, Bob Zanotto? Uh, what? Excuse me? Oh, uh, hello. What are you doing up here? Not sure. Probably something to do with plants, I'll bet. I was always really into that kind of stuff. So Bob and Helmut were together, and Bob is broken for losing Helmut in the battle with Maligula. And, uh, well, we'll meet him as well. He's, he's, his story is next Tuesday. Lucretia? Lucretia Mux? Please call me Lucy. Hi. I don't want to make things awkward, but you kind of murdered my grandma. Well, I don't know who your grandma is, kid, but uh, I don't doubt it. I murdered a lot of people. Why 
didn't you murder all those people? I don't really know. I was the nicest person during my time at Green Needle Gulch. What were you doing at Green Needle Gulch? Otto Mentalis recruited me to use my powers for hydraulic titanium mining. Which kiss he told us was very bad for the environment, but nobody listened to her as usual. Don't you also go by another name? Oh, what? Colloquio Max Maligula, Grolovia Spain, Vetwanda, the Wetwanda. one. Was a stage name <laughs> on Earth that was banned in three countries. What? Wait, what? <laughs> I forgot about this. What the frick am I supposed to think about that? What Wanda? An act that was banned in three countries. Hmm. What could she be doing? Is it like in South Park? The girl with the... Was it... Which uh, actress was it? I forget her name. Damn. I'm thinking... The... The same lady who plays the, the mother in uh, Stranger Things. Damn. Venona Ryder. Yeah, Venona Ryder doing the ping, bo ping pong ball trick. That's, that, that, that sounds like that, you know. <laughs> no hands. <laughs> Did you used to be friends with Cassie? Cassie tried to be friends with me, but I was too busy making Google eyes at Fort Crawler. Google eyes? I ruined everything, you know. So before you became Maligula, you were a nice, normal person? People are complicated, kid. Uh, you're too young to get it. I'm gonna go. Try not to kill anybody. <laughs> okay, I'll try. <laughs> no promises. Her earrings and her, like... The, the wrinkling of her scarf looked like another face. Like, that's the first thing I saw. So that's... That's Nona. Well, you know, that's the person that's now Nona. But, you know, there's still more to learn. Don't dismiss her just yet. Remember, she was the nicest of them all. Oh, look, there's a steamer trunk. So we did the full round, right? Nothing else left. Lots of bees. Bees everywhere. Oh, we can land here, can we? Should, should I have done that? No, that works. I need the steamer truck tag for this guy. So there should be a switch or something here, right? Oops. Wait. Here I am here. What does this tell me? What can I do anything? There's gotta be a switch I missed somewhere. Let's look around. I must have. Wait, it's gotta be something to open that other area. Maybe I'm just supposed to send the... Oh, wait, maybe I'm doing it wrong. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, there's the switch down there. This was just the area I could have explored right away. Yeah, I get it now. All right, mental construct, I mean archetype, go. Yeah, that's why. Well, it's... Uh, it's it's emotional baggage, uh, Delmar. In both games, you got that in every level. Every, in every person's head, you'll find emotional baggage. So, what was it? From the from the first one, the, the, the steamer trunk we just saw, then the... What is that one? I always forget that one's name. Then the suitcase, the pink one, then the head box we don't have, and the purse, the last one, the green one. So, it's like emotional baggage of the person. You gotta find the right tag and pair it with it. It's Basically a collectible, but yeah. Hello, Left for Poop. Welcome to the stream, Poopy. Hope you had a good day at work, my friend. Probably just got home from work. Still kicking the shoes off. How you doing? But yeah, Delmar, that's why. They're all crying, so you, the only way to suit them is to find their tags. Oh, hello. Hey, are you... William Shakespeare? Forsooth, etc. Oh, wow. <laughs> you don't really talk that way. No, I just like to give the fans what they want. Bizarre. <laughs> God. Gum, gum, gum. Congrats, man. How Vacation a week. How about me? Well, I haven't had a vacation since 2015. But that's not what you asked, is it? I just like saying that. I'm, 
I'm trying to make a record here. <laughs> I'm doing great. I was just telling, uh, I was just saying earlier to Delmar, you know, we're, we're feeling great. There's a lot of work. It's also tiring. But man, it's also reassuring, you know. You just can't do it all at once. <laughs> Well, just, you know, no, no opportunity. That's like decided, decided to go the, the freelancing way than to open my own company. And I can't stop because there's always a project. We were first, we were getting up on our feet, right? When we got on our feet around 2021, we were like, let's buy a house without the loan and anything. That's got to be a perfectly good idea. But it is a good idea. You know, it was, we, we knew we were going to work a lot and all that just it seems longer while it's happening once it's done yeah we just didn't want it we wanted to have a place then even if we're out of work and done you know have nothing left like no salary or anything no one can kick you out it's your house at least that's how it works in serbia i know the, the mortgage is a real thing in in the west but you know we bought a we bought a not dilapidated house but pretty like run down pretty just like unkempt basically uh no one took care of this place, and it's solid, but there's no go. Ah, oh, never mind. He left me. It's pretty solid, just needs work, and, you know, work needs money, and yeah, you know. Well, good news is we got, we got, what's the word? I don't know how you call it in English. Which is a big deal. So, how do you call it in English? So, it's not legalized yet, but basically the... Yeah, well, yeah, it's the first step. It's not legalized yet, like as a property, but since we bought it as is, seems that things are gonna go good way finally. Oh no, no, I'm very lax with that, Delmar. Ask away. Don't be shy. If I don't want to share something, I'll just say, "Sorry, Mario, your princess in another castle." <laughs> it's uh, I mostly do. Well, I do. Let's say two things the most. Project management, I've helped, like I remote manage companies, mostly in the UK and US. Right now I'm having a, I've been with the same client for a long time. I believe in his work and you know, it works well for me. It gives, gives me that psychological safety. And video editing, which ties into the all of this, right? Yeah, I've always liked video and always liked playing games and talking about games. So, you know, like, for money for clients i edit videos for youtube uh, vimeo whatever their private corporate websites but you know and after that my second job is literally this like the my unpaid second job because i take this seriously you know despite everything hello profit play thank you for the site my friend good evening well it's evening here it's like afternoon there maybe noon how you doing profi we got so many professors here. Check out Profi's playing Resistance. What else are you playing nowadays? That's not, not not just Resistance. I've seen you play other things as well, Profi. But he started out on Twitch at least with a lot of Resistance. Boy, I mean a lot of Resistance. Good Resistance games. No problem, Profi. But yeah, that was I was saying, you know. So after my actual work, well, so I work until like two hours before stream usually. I want to do it much less, but it's like that. Then I have about two hours to get dressed, eat, I mean, shower, get dressed, eat, all that. It sounds like I'm working naked here, but no, you know, just after shower. <laughs> and uh, straight to the stream. So, like, I got up at, what, 7 a.m. this morning? No, I slept in till 9 because <laughs> I went to bed late. But, yeah, and immediately there were meetings. There was work all the way to uh, two hours before stream. And then, like I said, I take this seriously. I It's... Ideally, I would like to make videos for YouTube, you know, about games and stream on, well, Twitch, Twitch is slowly shooting itself in the foot, but stream, you know, about games, but you know, it's not, it's not enough income to drop my main stuff yet, so basically working four jobs, if you think about it that way, <laughs> yeah, human stuff, but I do try to, you know, stick with the schedule and all that. We all like security, right? Any kind of security. Oh, there's a half a mind there. There you go, finally. It's it's an actual half a mind. Do you know any spells that help find books? Of course. Yeah, that is right, Left for Poop. It's hard managing the whole company by myself, you know. Sasha helps a lot, but I also... 
How do you put it? There are some things you can't have multiple, well, as we would say in Serbia, you can't have multiple uh, midwives to deliver a good baby. Just one midwife is enough. So, you know, I do, I put in all the time I can. We're, we're she's, she says often, I'm often daily that I'm overdoing it, especially with the streams. She'd like me to have, you know, at least one stream less a week. And I'm ideally like, why can I have one job less a week and, you know, more streams? Because I would like, I want to finish this game. I want to play the redeem game. I have so much in plan in the long term schedule. Just time flows in its own tempo, you know, we're just slaves to it all in a way. I'm Raz. What's I your need name? more water. Say my name and I shall release the child. <laughs> Shorty, Lance, I gotta try. I really gotta try. Shorty? I shall turn you into a frog for that. It doesn't matter Oh, no. I thought the baby was creepy. So I sold it. Oh, I should have said his real stuff. name. I was gonna... See, you never know what's... I'm Raz. What's your name? Say my name. Okay, here we go. All right, I want to see the last one. Here we go. Rumpelstiltskin. <laughs> no, wait, is that someone feel bad? <laughs> feel bad for that guy. He is Lance. Uh, it doesn't matter anyway. I thought the baby was creepy. So I sold it to the pretzelmeister. I didn't forget about my granny. My granny's a good granny. She's a she's a she's a bound granny. Bound, bound granny, bounty granny. <laughs> All right, let's say Lance Rats. this time. What's your name? Say my name, and I shall release the child. He says und, but they write end. Lance? Hey, did somebody tell you? Well, the subtitles. Uh, it doesn't matter anyway. <laughs> the baby was creepy, so I sold it to the pretzelmeister. Pretzelmeister, you say? Ooh. I need no I need one more. That sloshy wet sound of rains. Did I talk to him already? I think I did. Jester? Hi, I'm Raz. And I am the Fisher King, last guardian of the Holy Grail. Oh God. Then where's the Grail? Currently in the dishwasher. The dishwasher? Top shelf boy. Gentle cycle. Don't worry. So I. I th that's also a book, isn't it? Well, I don't know about the story, though. It, it, there is a story, right? Yeah, okay, there is a story. That's right. And that's what they reference in the movie. With uh, Robin Williams. It's a fucking depressing movie. It's one of his finest, probably. Where do I want to go? Up first? Or first the shelves? Let's go the shelves first. Bretzelmeister. Where did I see that video? Who sent that where? Where uh, they compare Turkish, Serbian and what else was there? You can see how... Was it G German? You can see how many borrowed words we have. Well, you know, from Turkish there's a clear reason. Well, for German as well. Hey, it's not raining in here. No, this is just a fashion phase. It distracts people Umbrella from goblet. my nose. Wait, I didn't check there. Ah, oh, where's my... I forget there. Well, we have quite a few German German words. For instance, we call the screwdriver Schaftziger. That's like the first thing off the top of my mind. We have a lot of German words. Haha. <laughs> nice. Scary. Oh, you think so? Why, thank you. That really makes my day. Yeah, Schaftziger. Schaftziger, I guess, in the, in German. Oh, wait, that's not what I want. Boop. They all see me as paper. Oops. All right, like a grandpa, I press too many buttons at once. Wait, let's stop it. Zoom. Zip. Zip. Hello, who are you? Please, pirates don't really talk that way. Oh, sorry, I. They talk like this. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I know. It's just like we we because Serbian goes, you know, you write it the way you say it. That's applied to all the bo borrowed words as well. L literally, not kidding. So, no, it does this? Please don't move. No, the other one moves. All right. So, like, I'm pretty sure. I think about this stuff often, actually. I'm pretty sure it was some like medieval Serbs, uh, you know, doing. Wasn't there something here? Doing a trade with the Austrians. And, well, that's literally what they did. They heard the word and they wrote, you know, they written it the way they heard it. And that's how it stuck in here. That's my theory. I'm pretty sure it's like that. Yeah. All right, let's go back there. Whoop. Is that a... Is that a figment? It's hard to say. Is that a figment or just random cobwebs? I think it's random cobwebs. Does this one move? Nope. Already asked that question. Whoop. Is there something there? Why Why would it be here? Probably something's gonna move. Oh, so I, you can get to that one. That's why. Oh. So you can keep on going, huh? Yeah, that's where I'm supposed to go, actually. Alright, let's wait for here. People here say things like, I don't know, Schlauf. <laughs> Reif, Reif, how would you even say that in German? I don't know, but like in Serbian, it's Reif, <laughs> Many German words in the Texan dialect. Yeah, there were a lot of German settlers there, weren't there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Reifeschluss. <laughs> With Le Schluss. <laughs> Excuse me, Ms. Witch. The zipper. But can I borrow your magic wand? Sorry, sorry. I'm just roasting a marshmallow here. <laughs> <laughs> Ach, Reifeschluss. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I should probably, if I weren't lazy with little free time I had, I would, uh, I would learn more uh, German and French and Italian. Well, Spanish before that, but yeah. Wasn't Austria-Hungarian Empire part of Serbia? Yeah, that's the thing I was saying. So. For about 500 years, this region was under control of the Ottoman Empire. The, 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 this part of Serbia, the northern part of Serbia was under Austria, Austrian Hungarian Empire's uh, influence or control even. So they were always, it's like from history books, from what we learned, it feels like they were always like, you know, we both have big dicks, let's just not wave them in each other's faces and You'd, you'd expect they clashed more, but they, you know, it's they were more focused on keeping. What would you even call that? Their colony here, I guess. Swedish. Well, that shouldn't be. That's a Germanic language. That's like Swedish, like, Swedish Norwegian. It's right in between German and English. Well, you could say that for for uh, Holland, Netherlands, Dutch, Dutch for Dutch as well, right? I didn't check if there was something else behind it, but that's okay. I really gotta get a glass of water. I'll be right back. This one looks easy. Uh oh. I think I just jinxed it. <laughs> My man. <laughs> All right, folks, just one second. Be right back. Not even gonna go to be right back screen. Just gotta get a glass of water. I'm, I'm still here. So family member, not like family names, because I immediately thought of like son and daughter. Oh no! Fuck, you did jinx it, Raz. Alright, so what am I missing? Am I gonna fall to my death? No, if I do it right, I'm not gonna fall. 
Oh yeah, we do that too. So yeah, same, same. Not well, I don't know about grandmother, but like for uncle and aunt, it's confusing when an English speaker say like he's my uncle. That doesn't tell us much because we have different words from for mother's brother, mother's sister, father's brother, and father's sister. I think sisters are both aunts are always tetka, right? No, actually, if it's your mother's brother wife mother brother's wife it's different than if it's your mother's sister you know we have words for each one of them yeah it's confusing well i think it's the roots germanic right we have we have quite a lot of latin as well well you know from b before all of this i talked about you know romans were no no don't don't slide romans were in this region like we still have roman buildings around Belgrade, the Roman well, for instance, all around the country, really. So it makes sense we get some Latin. Wait, that's a that's a figment if I've ever seen one, yep. And I've seen quite a few. <laughs> yeah, yeah, German does have that, like making them all. Where was that? Oh, that Euro trip when the, that's, uh, that's actually in the uh, in Netherlands, but still. What was it, Belgium? I, I know they were Dutch. In that sex... The, in that sex part? You spelled X wrong? <laughs> Why am I going back? Uh, that sex dungeon part where the safe word is like this this long uh, Germanic word, flugen, schlucken, klacken, something like that. Like, what the fuck do you read this? <laughs> How do you pronounce this? Oh, I want, I want to get that AB. Come back here, AB. At least you can climb easy. I love this kind of music. It reminds me of F1 race on the Game Boy. She works this team. In here, but be careful. Oh. This is the shop of Fanny Flats, the famous counterfeiter. Fanny Cassie Flats. For a counterfeiter? I work for myself, but I do what I need to survive. Oh wait, I'll read that. Parents dumped us here. We needed an archetype that was a little more thick-skinned. Cassie, we've come to bust you out. Did someone say bust? What was that? Huh? Shh. Never say bust here too loudly. But it's true. We have a plan. Oh hey, Teach. Listen, now's not a really good time. Flats has a big deal coming up, and she's really on edge. And I'm working on my ticket out of here. Can we help? Listen, don't tell anyone, but the cops are closing in on this place. The boss's days are numbered. I cut an immunity deal for myself. I just need to get them some evidence they can use against the big gal. But she's huh. watching everybody like a hawk these days, and I can't get away. We'll do it. I'll get the evidence you need, and we'll b we'll briskly walk out of here together. <laughs> okay? Deal. But remember, never double cross a double crosser. That was informative. Oh, there's there's that part. That's the part we're getting there. Wow, it is a big level. Okay, I need three pieces of evidence. Better split up. Wait, who am I talking to? <laughs> talking to himself. Autobahn, Autobahn, Rast, let me see, Rast, Totten. A restaurant besides it. So Autobahn Autobahn Rastatten Rastatten restaurant besides it. So that's like highway something is it like highway restaurant bathroom? Highway restaurant what's besitzer? Bes it's not besides it, it's besitzer I guess. Hello Classic Swayze, welcome to the stream Sway CSZ CSZ yeah, man, oh, you got into, like, every level is different than amazing, but you got into a very interesting one. We're inside a, a let's say, we're inside a head of a lady that has some murky past to solve. How you doing, Swayze? You streaming something tonight? More, uh, more cyber, cyber gunk? <laughs> Yeah, all the levels are 
There are there are some there is some free roaming area in the real world, but all the level. So these you see these colorful things, they're all figments of their imagination. They're collectibles, but yeah, it's a very good. Uh, you you've heard all the praises. You gotta check it out. This is the second game, but they're both amazing. Oh look, this one's hiding. My mental con mental construct is missing. That's a... is that a pig pulling a cat on a wheelchair? Jesus Christ. No stream today. Well, have a good rest, my friend. That's... As much as we love this, as much as we love this, we do need rest, do we? So, she did say three pieces of it. Oh. Right? Turns out the Green Needle Witch is none other than Cassiopeia, the author of Mindswarm. Now what or who is controlling her mind to keep her from helping me with the bees? Alright. Let's check all the docks. There's a lot of figments here. Look, we're not even halfway there in this level. I think I hear something. Emotional baggage. There's the guy. This guy needs a duffel bag. So that's the duffel bag. There you go, Delmar. That's the one whose name I forgot. Now I, I think I can remember them all. So... Steamer trunk, duffel bag, uh, the pink one is suitcase, then hat box, then purse. Yeah, five per person. Five emotional baggages. I really want to take that. Is it going to start sailing? No, it's not. Good. No, don't, don't touch the water! What's that sound? Yep. Whoop, 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 whoop. Ah! <sighs> Alright. The water is also out to get you. The... My family's been cursed by a water curse. Well, basically, if, we, if any of us touch the water, we die. That's why the hand is coming up. Except, I don't want to spoil it, Sway, so... <laughs> that one's kind of in the water. Well, I gotta touch it. Look, it's right there. Oh, there you go. So she has a lot of ship figments. I think she, that's because she wanted to leave. Oh yeah, the boxes will help with that one, I see. Can we do that? You know what, I'm gonna sacrifice for this figment. Nope, can do it. Can totally do it. And there he goes. Nice, Raz, nice. I think that's all here, right? I don't hear or see anything for now let's get into the main street anything up here no all the flags so this is cassie's part part of cassie's yeah. past in china right right <laughs> hi kitty yeah. don't eat the fish it's full of mercury yeah. oh that's horrible that's just horrible <laughs> what does the cat see me as a drawing, right? Well, most people here see you as drawings. Officer? Hey, kid. Are you investigating Fanny Flats? Sorry, kid. Can't, you know, comment on an ongoing investigation. Like Officer Snake? <laughs> are investigating Fanny Flats? I didn't say nothing. What are you investigating? Well... I'm thinking of investigating weird little kids with goggles who have recently drifted in from out of town. Any idea where I can find some evidence of Fanny Flats' crimes? Corruption runs deep in this town, kid. You can find evidence of it everywhere. Especially in the fish cannery, the print shop, and the market. So fish cannery, fish cannery, print shop, and the market. We'll go in that order if possible. What would you do with evidence if you were to hypothetically find some? Oh, we'd use it to put the squeeze on Fanny, of course. Like, legally speaking? Yeah, yeah. Totally <laughs> legal. <squeeze. sighs> I'll let you get back to work. Stay out of trouble, kid. Stay sexy, snake. Look, the grass. What are you? Turtle. There you go. It looks like Mr. Pokilo, but it's not. There you go, Delmar. I need to find 
find some evidence, quick. Slow and steady. Wins the race? Wins the... Race? Evidence. <laughs> <sighs> so... Three location, three pieces of cry. Hey, seen any evidence, evidence. around here? Nope. If I did, I'd remember. I'm an elephant. I noticed. You noticed what? That you're an elephant. Yeah, I am. What about it? He's got a little <laughs> demented elephant. <laughs> Oh, bookworms are back. Hi, guys. Hi, worms. Yo! Do either of you know which way the fish cannery is? Yes, yeah, over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We take you there, but the smell is out of control. Which way to the print shop? Oh, you do not want to go over there. They're counterfeiters. Yeah, we know. Shh. That's why we want to go there. How can I get to the market? That's way over there. Don't bother. Prices are nuts. Oh, I remember the market, the Chinese market. What do you know about Fanny Flats? Uh, she runs this town with her fake money business. But she doesn't control us bookworms. Bookworms. Every time she tries to cut us down, we just multiply. <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. We see a toidle with a with a trench coat. <laughs> Have any, uh -huh. Do you have any evidence that incriminates Fanny Flats? Oh yeah, we just uncovered a big juicy piece of evidence this morning. Can I have it? We ate it? What did you expect? Okay, bye. If you see any juicy evidence, please don't eat it. Okay! <laughs> so, wait, wait. Why does one of them sound like a kid and the other one sound... Oh, I'm a book on a plate for him. And the other one sounds like a adult New York dude. Yeah, what's to you? <laughs> oh, there's a those are bookmarkers? Bookmarks? Bookmarkers? Cat. Alright, so from here we wanna go to the fish cannery first, right? That was the first location, I think. Yep. Ah, uh, how about how about that pole, huh? Maybe like this. Ooh, that was close. That was close indeed. So how do I go from here? Oh, you gotta climb the sardine things. I think when you walk on them, I remember a special sound when you walk on them. Yep, that was the sound. Oop. So they're not there for long. That's that's the sound. Pink. Actually, I can just climb here, right? Whoop. Perfect. Perfect. Yo, boss. Take a look at this guy, boss. Want to be sleeping with the fishes? See? All right. Enough of being the Italian mobster. Fatsoo! I guess that's how you climb. Up. There we go. We infiltrated the fishery cannery. Hiya! Where am I? What's that? Pack and chip? Pack and chip? I think I smell some ripe evidence nearby. Better investigate. Is there something else out there? I'll be back to 100% this level. It's like too big. I mean. The the go, go, go. curiosity is killing me a little, but I like that boat over there. I saw it on the boat that it's it. eating me that I didn't get it. Oh no, you fish! You don't even have cool bones or anything. Just there to dick around with you, huh? All right, we gotta do this. I sacrificed for the greater good! That did not turn out the way I wanted, honestly. I wanted to do this. Oh, you can't slow them down. Well, that's... cheap. Another fish, and another tag. Ah, here's the hat box. 
We just need the headbox now. Where's that one? Whew, the sacrifices I made for this town. There's another tag up there. All right, that'll be all the tags then, right? Yeah. Oh, wait, there's more missing. So that's not gonna be all the tags. There's a door. That's a figment. Easy to miss. Humor? What? What humor? What are you talking about? This is a serious place. No? Alright, let's go in. Get some evidence. I missed it four minutes ago. How does that happen? I keep looking at this thing and then I'm like, Oh, look, the message came in four minutes ago. Where am I? I want to climb. This music reminds me a lot of the Final Fantasy XII music. Like, it's the same kind of composition, isn't it? Alright. No, don't do that. I guess that's the that's how I was supposed to do it. Uh. T U V W. It's the alphabet. P Q R S. Why is that a figment? Because she's book smart. Why does she have alphabet as figments? There's a door. Oh, that's the evidence, right? The the magnifying glass. Whoop. Now this looks fishy. Better take it as evidence. That's exhibit C. I went to the first one you mentioned. Where is it? Where is the quest? Factory. First factory, then market. All right. So this should have been the third one. That's okay. I think that's the best evidence I'll find in this part of town. I should check out the other neighborhoods for more. Yeah, uh, I'm glad you think so, Carter. So the whole thing we talked about earlier, when uh, when something's uh, something's written in a in a way that doesn't feel like tacked on later. Yeah, so they. In the first game, you don't even see... So you don't see Cassiopeia, you don't see Compton Bull, you do see his grandson, he goes to the camp with you. You don't see who else is missing. Well, of course, Hollis Forsyth isn't there, Truman's an auto, Bob's an auto. So you don't see a, a lot of these seconds. You just see Ford, you don't know what happened to him yet. You see there's something weird. He's everywhere, but not remembering the other cells. You see Sasha and Mia, that's it. But the others are there when you're, there's an area, the campfire, the welcoming area, where the game starts, where the intro starts. You can see all of them, including Lucretia Mux. So it was all written for the first game. Maybe they didn't have the time to put it in there. They, maybe they, they planned the sequel ahead. I don't know, but it's like really well, well written. The whole fear of water, the curse, the why Augustus, uh, Raz's dad, has an aversion to water and psychics. His mother taught him, yeah, it's all amazingly written. I didn't expect much the first time I played the first game. Then when the second one came out, I just had to play it. Immediately dropped everything. Sasha and I were like, yep, Psychonauts 2 is out. Day one, play it. Luckily, it was a game pass, and I had to go back to the first game right after that. Because I couldn't believe what I just saw, you know, I didn't believe the... I thought it was gonna be zany and all that, but then, man, it hit the feels. That's what I like about the games, that's what I... That's why I like being a story streamer. I love stories, what can I tell you? Well, how do I even get to that fish up there? It's just there to taunt me. They're all there, look, there's a little wolf thingy. Can you climb the poles? I really have to try. Can you climb the poles? Yeah, you can climb the poles. That's how. All right. Way less tricky than I thought. Let's follow the lane for now. Look, this level is all about water. There's quite a few places in the games where it puts you in a shit ton of water and goes, survive, boy. There's the headbox. We got your tag. <laughs> ah, 
<laughs> Where's Tim Schaefer from? Schaefer kind of sounds like German Finnish name. I don't know where he's from, honestly. Like what heritage? No, no, no. I want to go back to solid land so I can climb this one. It's the storks. This one just... Oh, no! Don't, don't fucking bounce off of that. Oh, that was pretty cool. Not gonna lie. <laughs> There's another fish. No, give me your bones. There you go. Good. Now I gotta get that boat in the middle. Is that all of them? Yeah, I got all of them. Alright. We're gonna climb down. It's a typeset. I love that sound they're making, the pink sound. You know what, go in whatever order. Since they're fucking around with me, I'm gonna fuck around with them. Climb quickly, climb quickly. Am I blind? I am. I'm old and blind. Now where was it? It was over there. Yeah, Tim Schafer. Schaff Schaffer, I guess. Schaffer. Well, I guess I gotta chase those thoughts now. They're right in the f in my face there. Oh wait, maybe that's where they want me to go. Fuck it, I'm going in. Oh cool, I didn't even realize that one. Yep, there it is. So that's for coming back. I'm gonna bet that's for if you fuck up, you can come back. Yep. If you miss your ride. No, I fucking overflow it! Okay, oh, saved by whatever. Why? Flip around, Raz. Raz? You can do it, boy. Why? Was it Y? Was it... Shit, what was the turnaround button? It should be Y. You, know, you can't turn around on the trapeze, but you can still go up. There's gonna be a cutscene or something here, I remember. Or more bookworms. Whoa! All right, here we go. One, two, three, four. Hiya! Oh, hiya! Hiya! What? Oh shit! I didn't get one of them. No! Didn't want to open again. All right, and that's why this is. If you fuck up, you can go back. Reminds me of a creepy pasta I can't find again. Is that site exist still? Creepy pasta about a game that deletes itself if you die in game. There are only limited copies available. The last one is sold for minions. But a buyer won't play because the developer has said a single sentence that revealed that every playthrough so far was wrong. It was one of those creepypastas that were actually written by authors. Huh. Reminds me of the Majora's Mask, Ben Drowned one. Possessed games, huh? Oh, this is the right direction to do that in. Whee! Alright, let's not fuck up this time. Oh, thank you for teaching me again, game. You, you think I forgot the way I did that last one. Oh, yep. oh it's a drawn fan. <laughs> We're in the market. Shit, I need, uh, need my buddy. And then I'm gonna put my buddy here. That's right. No, oh, yeah. And then uh, I need the side blast to be best. Stupid enabler with their stupid but well crafted rhymes. <laughs> Is 
Is he, is that an enabler helping an enabler? Just punch him till he dies. Are you bullying my archetype? He glitched, I think. This fish market is clean. For a fish market, I mean. <laughs> but just dirty enough to have some <clears throat> juicy evidence, I'll bet. My catfish is buttery and sweet and easy to eat. Carp seasoning, terribly old and rotten fish here. Catfish will help you grow a beard. Carp keychains. Fish with worms. <laughs> I don't need carp. Carp is garbage fish. Come get your carp. Fish that's past its prime. Here you go. Catfish here. Silver carp. Well, they're going to keep doing carp, that, huh? Black carp, grass carp, stinky fish. Put catfish in shoes to cure flat feet. Carp extract. Fishy fish. And by fishy, I mean its freshness is suspect. Ha! <laughs> Oh, interesting, Carter. Carp poetry, carp music, past its prime, my fish is sublime. Catfish will make you smarter. Carp air freshener. Huh, I like that kind of stuff. Like, um, mind fuck you, like the, uh, what's it called? The Twilight Zone. Or, you know, from Alan Wake, the, that show, the, the Night Springs. Well, it's the Twilight Zone. Big head carp. Let's talk to him. Hi, I'd like some carp. Don't have any. After all of that. that on your back? Plastic samples. I'm just doing test marketing. Tell me, how likely are you to buy carp in the next 10 days? But th does the site exist? You know, I haven't thought about that. I haven't read that site since 2011. 2012 was the last time I remember reading something from it. Uh, how likely? I don't know what she said. Fuck, I wasn't paying attention. I guess... Extremely, extremely likely. likely. Thank you for taking our survey. You've automatically been <laughs> added to our mailing list. Oh, great. <laughs> gotta get some good dirt on Fanny. <laughs> we'll get that. No, not that. That. Oh, I'm just a bill for her. Just money. Some money are here. I don't understand what I just picked up. I could have insulted someone's mother. Wasn't there a site, Creepypasta, maybe even Creepypasta.com, where there was a collection of Creepypastas? How did you read those? Like, that's how I read them. Yeah, archives. I guess we could find it in the Internet Archive. Yeah, <laughs> I look the same as my archetype. It's so weird. Sorry, but why would anybody want to buy rotten fish? Listen, all the fish in this market is rotten. I'm telling you the truth. Fair enough. Yeah, I mean, he's onto something. The Internet Archives has, like... You just gotta remember what it's called, right? Still just money, alright? So they're... Because they're sellers, right? Merchants. I'll have some catfish, please. One catfish ish coming up. Catfish ish. Ish? It's so close to catfish. You can't taste it. <laughs> Never mind. Carp, they haven't named yet. 
Romance fish. Packs a punch. Ugh. I don't need carp. Carp is garbage fish. Carp air freshener. Past its prime, my fish is sublime. Come get your catfish. Carp seasoning. Stinky fish. What does this remind me of? Make you smarter. Carp that looks like octopus. Fish with worms. Catfish will make you. <laughs> Various sites, podcasts, YouTube vids, forum posts, chains, chance sites, wikias. Yeah, I just I just use fucking creepypasta.com. <laughs> but yeah, I did find I did find find out from reading shits shits. Reading shit on forums. Different forums. I think I read my first one actually in, in the Zelda Universe forum. Man, I think that was last, around 2018, I visited that site. Life just got different, and then, you know, I keep thinking from time to time, I gotta go there, see, see my old friends, you know, whoever is still there and remembers, but I, I never do, fuck. Were some f check Cicada 3301? Cicada? How do you pronounce it? Cic Is that the bug, the insect that comes out every 20 years? But this one, this one eats people's faces. While it makes them hallucinate, they're riding a rainbow bike. Prince of Persia? What about Prince of Persia? <laughs> I Google now on, on, well, if you duck, duck, go, then you don't Google, then you duck, duck, go it. <laughs> It's a bird! It's a plane? Maybe it's... It's super dude. Oh shit, you can break your legs on words? I guess words can hurt me. Yeah, the cicada. The Oh, there's this... Yeah, I didn't know about the bird. Maybe because it eats cicadas? What are they pronounced? Oh, the way... Yeah, I love... I can't wait to stream that one as well. Like I said... Not enough time for all the games. I still haven't finished. I still haven't started the third game. I started it, but the second one was kind of disappointing. But I would love to finish that and then, you know, stream all three. The proto Assassin's Creed. Wait, a Cicada. What, how, what do we call it? I think we call them Cicada. Cic we just call them Cicada, I guess. Aha. This looks like evidence. We're going backwards. Um, CBA. Something. Oh, that's it. Now I gotta get to the door. Is that the only door? No. Climb. Why ain't you climbing, my boy? There you go. You gotta do it Metroid Fusion style. So do you have to use... Oh, I think I could have just slid down without using... Because I'm thinking, what if you just have one HP at this point? Can't summon my archetype here. Nope. Not like that. You just slide down. Just one more piece of evidence to find. Okay, the last one is where whatever they said was the last thing. Oh, the print shop. That's the one we haven't been to. We can slide down back again. They all have these awesome exits. Do I believe there's something behind one of the stalls? Maybe. But if there is, we'll come back here again. Not really expecting to 100% this level in the first go. As you can see, it's a large one with multiple areas and all. Whee! Yippee! Zoom! Wappity doo! Wow! Alright. I'm normal again. So now we gotta go to the print shop. Puzzle challenge that randomly popped up over the internet. Mostly on shady places. One of the most prevalent pre prevalent 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 theory theories was that it was one of the surveillance. Do you believe that? Hey, I'm not saying anything it's impossible. I think that I in fact I think a lot of shit is possible. And like I said the other day for the ghost stuff, oh my god, that would be in a way, would the world would be way more interesting, but... 
Nothing's conclusive about that kind of shit, yeah? I have, don't care, I haven't dug it. That's how you stay sane, my friend. Uh, <laughs> that's exactly how you stay sane. You, you cracked it, man. Yeah, I remember these boats. Now I can just hop from boat to boat if I do it good. And grab all the pigments. Can you slow down the boats? What would happen if I did that? Nope. There's gotta be more. Yeah, there are more. Four. We need five for the next upgrade. Alright, is that it? Anything else left? Oh, shit. So only the archetype can go here, huh? I gotta go up. Is that a monkey? Are you calling me a monkey man? It was just alive and nearby when it was happening. So was that like was the I, I'm curious like if it was that for real? Because it would have it would have been some X-Files shit. Come back, B. I wanna eat you. Come back. Oh there it is. Hiya! Oh, I should have used the super jump. See where it goes. Up, 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 up. Nice. Yep. Now let's get my bearings back this way. A beehive. That's not bad. 220 out of 202 out of 227. That's in fact that's amazing. From Wiki. The stated purpose of the puzzles each year was to recruit highly intelligent individuals, although the ultimate purpose remains unknown. Theories have included claims that Cicada 3301 is a secret society with the goal of improving cryptography, uh, privacy, and anonymity, anonymity, or that is a cult or a religion. <laughs> Must be on drugs. According to statements of several people who won the 2012 puzzle. 3301 typically uses non-puzzle based recruiting methods but created the Cicada puzzles because they were looking for potential members with cryptography and computer security skills. D end. I mean slash end. That sounds really interesting. I wonder if it's true. Resolution. Those who answered the satisfactory at this stage were invited to a private forum where they were instructed to devise and complete a project intended to further the ideals of the group. He did not finish his work on a method of general decryption and the website has removed, was removed. Slash and... <laughs> Alright, so... What can my buddy do here for me? Oh, shit. Sorry. Gotta... Take care what buttons I press. Why can he exist? Can I, why can I make him? Where is he? There we go. I'm an ugly person. <laughs> Come here, you. Got it. Easy squeezy. Sure, sure. Oh shit! No, 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 no! Oh, okay. I was a little hasty there. Tell me it stays open. Please tell me it stays open. Ah! Wait. Oh, wait. That's the door, actually. Fuck! I went the wrong thing. I was in the right place. I just wasn't looking. Do it again. Where'd he go? Why'd he stop? Oh, because I fell into water. I gotta stop yelling at my archetype. You sure you squeeze me? Why do I have to do all the hard work? Well, you're the thin one here. Oh, right, we need more evidence. Hey, knock it off. Sorry. Didn't mean to jump on your head. Yeah, that would, that's what I would do. That's what I do do when I'm bored. I make airplane sounds. Yeah. Either that or like beatbox with myself. Aha! Oh, never mind. 
I'll, I'll get you next time, the gadget. Ah! Wait, where's the other one? Oh, that, that was my guy. That wasn't uh, Figment, was it? Oh shit, it's time for Goonades. <laughs> get out of there! They're gonna blow! Oh shit. Gotta kill them. Oh, you bastards! No, you bitch! That one's dead. Boom! All right, we get the last guy. Let's see if we can burn the the mage. Yeah, that makes him stop his shit. Why did I not think of that sooner? No, stop puking each other. Fuck off! That's pretty cool, you can actually stop him from doing shit with this. Can use guns right now, my boys. Oh, it's okay, I got you both. Die! Hmm, why not use both actually? Come here, well, I need my guy. Oh. Go help me, guy. Oh, can I burn him? I wonder. I think that would be pretty normal if I could burn him, but... What, do I, what am I missing here? I'm missing my shooty-shooty. So keep this, but keep this as well. Oh, God, you can burn him. Yep, makes sense, of course. But... Ah, boy. It looks like those guys just went out of print. Wait, what am I doing? Oh yeah, collecting evidence. Oh, he's just like me. Stop saying that so <laughs> You're just like me, right? What the hell am I even doing? My archetype is having fun. I'm my own best friend, am I? Yeah, indeed. Would you look at that? Ah, oh, we can open these now. That's the last tag. Thank you, my guy. Now get out of there. That's the one we were missing. Now we have them all, right? Or maybe not. Don't listen to me. Yeah, we're still missing the steamer trunk. Which I've seen somewhere, haven't we? Yeah, I've seen it from afar. Wowee, Mr. Archetype. I can enter there, but I'm not gonna. That's the way we're gonna go back. But I wanna see this place as well. Uh, I need you to move over there, my boy. Just stay there while I burn some shit here. I remember this, look at this. It's a portal book. You end up at a different place. Where there's this fish uh, fish uh, thing and there's a memory vault up there. Nowhere to run. Protect the queen. Cassie... Trying to fight Maligula with her book, Mindswarm. The motivational speech she talked about. Maligula just like drowned her or like made her spew water out of her belly or book. It's hard to say. Helmut died. We thought at least Helmut died. Crawler and his eyes always going like Grr! they always point like this. <laughs> I love him. And they're all there burying Helmut, his microphone, uh, hearts, hot dog. I guess he loved hot dogs. Wreath of flowers. Like, the kind of funeral I think Jack Black would enjoy. And why why is Otto the only one happy? That's the part I forgot. We'll, we'll find out. But they're, they're all... They're all... 
sad and shocked they lost one of their best friends and Otto's all like yeah we're opening the psychonauts woo I think he knew something that the others didn't he might have even known he had Helmut's brain I don't know Otto is a wild card wild card wild card wild card I love hot dogs too well hot dogs are awesome especially made well you know as long as they have zero pigeon and rat in them I love them <laughs> Then uh, Crawler went smelling shoes. No, he his mind was shattered. That's one aspect of Crawler. He wouldn't listen. He wouldn't even remember her. So she just left. Packed up and left. The, she felt very useless in there. She started working with her bees. And then slowly her feelings of uselessness and her sadness took over. Started protecting her. So that was, you have to go out of the way to get to that one. Pew, 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 pew. All right, let's go back. It's trippy, isn't it? There should still be one more tag somewhere. Is it over there? Or can I go there? Oh, God, I can't go there. I'm going to die. Oh, I'm dead. Nope, I'm even, even worse. I'm in a very uncomfortable place. At least can I go around the corner? No, 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 why would you just push me away? Oh, fuck you. A creepypasta that's not even made up. Well, then it's called fact and not creepypasta, right? What the fuck did I just do? I got myself trapped in nowhere on the Sun Hill now. Oh, God, I can't even climb. Fuck, do I have to go all the way around? You can do it, Red. You can do it, you old bastard. Ah, oh, never mind. I guess I'll have to take the long way up. Which was. Nope. Oh my god. No, come here, you can do it, Trevor! So it's right under there. Hey, I remember this fuck up at least. That says a lot. Right, guy, go in there. I would not do that if I were you. <laughs> he sounds like he was giving birth. There's some addition around the story, some some using that makes a terribly sad story creepier. Wow. No, why can't I? I hate when that happens. Like that's a super a super useful power, but when it happens when you don't want it, it's just annoying. I can't go there. Can you? Nope. See that slide? You gotta be careful so it doesn't act when you least expect it. Well, I don't see that tag. Oh, there it is. Is that it? No, nope. I've seen it from one of the. There's there 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 they are. See over there? There's a whole rank. You know what? Since we're gonna get the final one, it might end here. So I'm gonna go back before I go forward, you know. Five figments left. Man, very, very happy with how I've been doing these. So there's the tag and there's the half mine. No, that's a nugget. That's even better. Hey, hipster, my friend. What you doing, hipster? Hello, mutation. You old bastard. How you doing, mutation? What's up? Good morning. Oh, you did watch that. Yeah, that's right. They nerfed victims? Really? Wow, I did not expect that. Honestly, I did not. I thought they would, you know, if anything is getting nerfed, it's the family. Lay it on me, boy. Oh, let's not forget. Hold on. Pause the presses. Pause the presses. Mutation is in the chat. Mutation is no imitation. It's the real thing. The real deal. They nerfed the choose flight ability, which gave three stamina charges. Is that the one? No, that's not. I know there are a couple of powers for victims where you, you are forgiven things three times like 
Ignoring damage. I got that on Leland, I think. But I played Leland very little. Okay. Okay. Because that was that's stupid. Uh, as a killer, I should... That post you sent me, I don't know where it's from. I, did, I forgot to, to comment on that, did I? But uh, they're right. You, should, you shouldn't be, like, as a killer, you shouldn't be the one who feels pressured, you know? I shouldn't be on a pressure trying to kill some kids. They should be the ones who are scared. Oh, Danny, no, wait, I gotta see this. Danny will receive a nerf to his instant tamper ability. If he instant gathers knowledge of an exit, he won't be able to use his ability on that exit. How does that work? So, you mean if he studies on that thing, or he gotta use it on another thing, or something like that? That's interesting. Trying to keep, you know, try not to make the guy useless, but still, you know, make him bearable. I think, again, back to the point where I'm not going to say who here, Joseph, me, but uh, <laughs> keeps bitching about, oh no, they, ah, shit, never mind, better fall in the water, fall in the water, fall in the water. They escaped, how could we do this? My family will denounce me, but I guess if we, if we had... Good passage with Danny so far, that's gonna make it even easier, huh? That's good news. No, nope, wrong side. Don't be hasty. And look. Always look, my son. Hiya! Whee! Alright, somewhere around here. Yeah, there it is. See, I missed those. It's so easy to miss. Sounds like, Na uh, what's her face? Not Nancy Cartwright, the other one. The famous actress from... Where's that... Where's that other thing? It should be somewhere here, right? Fuck, I don't know where it is. Let's look around the books. I wish I could pull the camera back a little. I've seen it somewhere in a, in a little hole. Aha, uh -huh, so, okay, okay. Yeah, from what I understood, Danny, like, he goes around the house, the map. Uh, he can uh, gather knowledge on the radios, the lamps, anything elect anything mechanical, really, and then use that knowledge on the exit. I didn't know he can, maybe he can gather it on something, like, on the exit. Bomb squad ability for victims got nerfed, too, before victims could disable as many traps as they want, but soon... They will only be able to disable three traps in a single match. That's a good nerf. Like, he can only put down three traps. Where is that part, man? Where did I, where did I see that? I forgot. Do I have to jump down just to see where it is? I don't want to... No, it, it was somewhere here. I know I've seen it from this side. Is it above me? Is it below me? Below me. I guess I'll have to make a mistake to learn. Is it down here? Oh, fuck it, I'll just go to the bridge and repeat everything. hi -ya! Now look close. There it is. Fuck, I should have just kept going. Alright, I got you now, gadget nugget. Whoop! Shirtless Johnny, of course, it would be a shame not to put Johnny out of any clothes. They buffed up a character, a 70s male character, and left him in a, a, in a wife beater? I think not. That guy doesn't even have a wife. <laughs> but seriously. What about the other ones? Wait, Johnny, okay, that makes sense. I guess cosmetic, just <laughs> kind of lazy, just removing the clothing items. But you know, I'm not complaining. Ah! But what about the others? Oopsie. I gotta climb these books, man. I'm not gathering knowledge is hard. I think I'm gonna go up to the market and then get it that way. Let's try that approach. It is her. I swear it's her voice. 
Not Nancy Cartwright, the other one. God damn it. I love the actress. Mom. It's somewhere here. There it is. I don't care. I'm getting it. Hey, yeah. All right. We can upgrade projection right away. Your archetype has a thicker skin, so he can absorb twice as much damage. He'll be able to hang around and battle much longer. There you go. And the final one is seven paper cuts. All the nuggets completed. So all that's left is to sort the remaining emotional baggage. Bravo, and five figments. Wow, I clapped myself here. Did take quite a while, but man, it is a big level. A new trapping killer and a new victim will be coming out with him. So there's actually content. Fuck yeah, we're playing a game that's not gonna die instantly. Bravo for us. Bravo, Joe. Yeah, this is after Resistance, after Evil Dead. We'll come back to Evil Dead in a second. All characters are getting special cosmetics. There, there you go. Everybody who likes cosmetics, enjoy. I'm, a, I'm a, more of a useful perk guy, as you all know, but yeah. Tress McNeil, that's her. That you thank you so much, love. That is her. Fuck yeah, I found it. I found it. You, you just combine kind of like Arnold and uh, Cindy from Outbreak in one. What's the occasion? Did you find the creepy pasta? Well, let's get let's get back on the road, boys. Ah, we. Oh, no. Okay, that works. So where was the last one? Where did they go? Cannery? No, the cannery wasn't it. It was over there in the print shop. That's where I didn't do shit. Because I was afraid. I was afraid of the law. Because I am the law. The law. I can't do it like him. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I'm just kidding. I found it. Those are great news, uh, mutation. Uh, hear anything from Brown? As of yet, about either tonight or tomorrow night. Whew. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was going there. No! Oh, that was close. <laughs> hasty, hasty. Holy shit, it's been three hours already. Bravo game, you are interesting. Oh, what was that? Did you all see that? That was doped up. <laughs> the Brown Meister. Thank you. Well, if it's that good, Carter, it should be popular. Shh. I guess shit posted for now. I will. I've seen Discord has new things. I haven't had the time, like I said, to deal with that. But uh, I am planning on adding more shit to Discord. So for now, shit posted. Easy squeezy. Come on. Or oh, you can just stop using that. He looks like a flying pizza sometimes, doesn't he? Alright, let's go in there and get the final piece of evidence to put this... I've gotta get some good dirt on what's, this, what's she called? Fanny Flats. <laughs> let's put her on her flat fanny. That's two figments, so... What, I'm missing three somewhere? Unless there's another page. Yeah. Quinta apis contata e agelare vespa non anima animadverto. What the hell is that? I'm, I gotta brush up on my Latin. Yeah. Don't double jump when you're doing wall slides. Hiya! Haha! <laughs> oh, shh. Shit. Wait, if I go there, if I take the evidence, that will be it. I don't want to take the evidence just yet. Hui! 90 days or less until execution packs, weapon skin, execution pack, weapon skins, family and victim cosmetics, museum mode, virtual cabin, new victim and family member, shirtless Johnny, bride sissy, new map, the mill, and more coming this week, uh, month, year, this quarter at the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Available only on gun stores.
So, uh, you know, I like that a lot about Friday the 13th, man. The virtual cabin. I loved it. That's where I got most of the backstory of the characters, you know. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's one aspect I loved about that. Well, no, no, that's I love the multiple aspect, but yeah, I really like that one. This way, I guess. You know what I'm talking about? Did you? You probably. It's not even played it. It's like in, enjoyed it, I guess. The virtual cabin and Friday the Thirteenth. And that single player mode. If they made something like that for this, that would be cool. You know, even though. That was a big bone. That was a big plus in my eyes for Friday the Thirteenth. Not you don't have many. Uh, you don't have many isometric. No, what, what I'm saying, asymmetrical, isometric, <laughs> asymmetrical games uh, that do that. You know that that had a single player mode, and that was pretty cool. How you play different scenarios against Jason or like against the campers. Now this looks incriminating. I think that's all the evidence Cassie needs. That's all she needs, right? Let's go get that librarian. I got all the evidence I need. Better bring it back to Cassie quick. So we'll find the remaining whole three figments. Once we're back here for more collectibles. Wee! Yippee! Wah! Can't do that without sound effects. What's the point, really? Wait, Cassie. How do I even find Cassie? Through the door, I guess? Oh, there's a there's a figment. Look at that. So two figments. And there's a there's that emotional baggage. Emotional baggage. That's the duffel bag, right, man? I, hard to remember all the names. What's a duffel bag for? What's a hat box for? Is it really for hats? One more figment left. Oh, come on! Come, 226 out of 227. Like, how? What, am I supposed to not chase it now? Oh, fuck. I'll just do my best to ignore the painful fact that I'm missing a whole one figment of Cassie's imagination. We're not gonna talk about has that, like, the only thing that's missing in this level. I'm not gonna suffer. I promise. It's gonna be very painful. Why me? Why me? Okay, maybe it's up there. There it is. I found it. I found All right. All right. I gotta give myself a pat on the back. 227 figments. First try. That's it. I think I've collected every figment in this mine. Did we just... What are we missing? Missing one half a mine. 200% level and one emotional baggage which we've seen it right we've seen the the worm will tell us I'm not gonna do that I got all the figments I won I wanted the game I can just not install it now at this point let's go back to Cassie fanny flats where all the evidence oh shit there's more that's all the evidence we uh -huh. can get think it's enough let me be the judge. Oh, I didn't that. check the items. Oh yeah. I wonder what they would be. This is some hot dirt right here. We'll be able to blackmail her with this for years. Blackmail? I thought you were going to arrest her. What? How is she going to make the money she needs to pay us from jail? <laughs> she's not locked up, and she finds <coughs> out I was the one who sent her up the river. Hey, don't worry. We'll uh protect you or something. Or something. Let's beat it. Beat it. This was a bust. What? Bust? Oh, it's a bust. Oh. Accounts actual. Ew. Not a chapter of which I am particularly proud. Hey, she was forced into the outlaw life. Not that part. I just meant... Nobody likes a snitch. That's what Lobato had in his mind, there remember? you are. All safe and sound again. Thank you, young man. You were a little loud for my liking, but you got the job done. And now you'll help me with those bees? Oh, are you scared of bees? Well, <laughs> I know of she one is? place well, where you'll Queen feel Queen Bee it is, Sasha. Safe. You did win. Hey! Put me down! Can you put that in video game? In Discord, please? 
This was all Thank you. part of the plan. It was? Yep. And I thought I was the tricky one. Oh my, we've come to a bad place. Thank you, Mutation. No, it's perfect. How is it perfect? Any place is perfect. When we're all together. Well, I haven't seen you in a while. We should never have let her split us up. When we're together, nothing is impossible. For the well, tired brother it. senpai. I hate to damage a book, of course. But that last line was too corny. Even for a motivational speaker. We're not going to let you control us anymore. Oh, and which one of you thinks you should be in charge? None nice. of you could stop Maligula. None of you could protect your friends. I am the real Cassiopeia. Alright, it's time to close the book on her. Wink, wink. And I'll show you how we fight off a foreign invader. Vroom. Ready for the shushing of your life! <laughs> Dibrarian. Real librarians aren't like this. <laughs> Alright, what's your weakness? I, I, I'm gonna say I'm gonna need my archetype and probably fire. I, I would bet there's gonna be fire necessity as well. Where am I gonna put the fire? For now, here. Archetype, go! Alright, we gotta kill the guy. Yep, gotta need the fire. Zoom and then, nope, kill the sh shit out of them. Kill the shit out of them. Woo! Oh no, wait, that's my guy. Wait, was she doing that? Should I be able to do something? Where's the pen? Ah, I see what you want to want with me. All right, yeah, I'll keep this in the eye. All right, archetype, your turn. Oh shit, he's not even drawn. Okay, I don't know when he when he undrew himself. That's my cue. Let me in there. So they're all gonna work on her, basically. I'll see if I can write a better ending to this story. It's the writer, Cassie, right? What's going on? Who's in here? Oh, hello, Cassie. You, the self-righteous little writer. What are you doing in here? We writers are most effective when we get inside someone's head. <laughs> oh, Alright, let's get out of here. There's ink. Where's my PR department? Oh, there you are. Do they have a healer? Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. And it's protecting her as well. Interesting. Alright, let's let's get him. I'm gonna use that. And instead of telekinesis for once, I'm gonna turn off the fucking levitation. I call it telekinesis. I'm gonna leave pyrokinesis there. They're super weak to the shots now, because we got sensory overload. So now we gotta kill the... There we go. Oh, they're exploding bees. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so first let's kill the little guys and then, then we'll go for the real one. Where's the healer? Where's the healer? Need tell no now I need telekinesis. Oh wait, they didn't hurt her? What did I do wrong? Oh shit, she's breaking the thing down. 
Thrower ruler! You're killing my archetype! Oh, that's just rude. Poor guy, he doesn't stand a chance. Can I get a ruler, please? A ruler? He's shushing me? Oh no, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh! Because I turned it off. They'll come to me. Whoop! Look at this. Look at the area. Oh, that's how you tell a kinesis. Alright, let's dodge the bees and try to throw the ruler in her face. Whoop. That's the rule, right? Please don't move. Alright, we sent the little guy in there again. Quickly. Zip. It is. It's very tight controls. So good to play. So it's so pleasing to play. Honestly, both games are. Come on, stop. You don't need the fire. Alright, that helps. That helps. Without the healer, you're nothing. Oh, there's another one. Fuck off. No, 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 what the hell am I doing here? I always forget. I just, just walk towards her. How do I become heavier? Try, try levitation. Let's see what it does. No, no, try levitation. That did not work. All right, here we go. You just fight it. <laughs> Letter opener, all right. That's the last one, if I do it right, at least. Oh, shit. Uh, let's do that, that, and for now, we're going to do that. Like I'll show you how dangerous books can be. Oh, she's going to do that. All right, let's wait for her to finish with that. And then we'll stab her in the heart. Pow, right in the kisser. Goodbye, evil Cassie. Oh, it didn't hurt her enough, alright. I guess because she was shielding. Shush. Alright, one more time. She throwing another one? Well, not really when they're dicks like that, but okay. Uh, fire, uh, shoot, uh, time. Night. Uh, we have the time night. Woo, woo, woo. Fire, fire, just burn them. 
Can't heal anyone when you're on fire. Well, it kind of hurt me a lot. Oh. Ow! Ow! It's too much shit going on. Woohoo! Where's my time? Okay. Oh, the other one just killed himself. He offed himself without my help. The honey of enlightenment. Impartial little critic. Please, can I throw the thing at your face now? Nope. Oh, why did I expect to be easy? Where's the thing she threw? Ah! My, I forgot my tele uh, my levitation. I keep calling it telekinesis. Levitation? Levitation much? There we go. Press the wrong button, apparently. You're gonna need that and this. Where's the thing you threw, though? Didn't she throw something to help me? There it is. Go on, in the eye. What the hell? Where's my thing? Oh, I didn't. Oh, that's shit. Introducing that so late. All right, you blow. Blow it out of your ass. Oh, you can slow her down. There we go. It's short, but it works. <clears throat> Alright, the one last. You can do it. That and that. Oh, you little... Oh, they're doing the cross heal. Fuck you, enabler. More fire to him. Come on, restore my... Oh! All right, good. More bees, all right. Oh, you can actually hurt her. Wow. There you go. Wow, you don't even need to throw things on her. There was an easier way. Okay, time to end this. Get that gate open, kid, and I'll bust this whole crypt. Think, think, think. I'm gonna need just that. That's it. I got yeah, don't forget that. Alright, here we go, archetype. <laughs> Alright, go and clone of an ugly person. Blap. So many Cassie's. You say something stinks. You. Oh no. I can't handle all three of you at Two. Once. Two is okay, but three. That's kind of the point. Ready, gals? I'm ready. Together now. There we go, we did it. Wow, that... I can't believe I failed. It's a Again. big level. I guess, I guess I'm... Not the real Cassie. Yes, you are. And so am I. Me too. Mostly when we need money. Hey, I'm pretty good in a fight. You might have noticed. All right, they're merging into the one Cassie, the one true Cassie. Hi. She's going uh, all 
Are you the real Cassie? Hmm, not sure. But I'm sure she's in here somewhere. She's still a hippie now granny. Then, did you say something about my bees? All right, we're back in the real world. Woo! Oh my. They really aren't behaving, are they? Ha ha ha! That's it. I'm all out of bee puns, I promise. Think you can do something about them? I'll try. But I feel like I've... lost a little control of them. Oh, how I wish my old partner were here. I think they just need a nap. Oh, bully! How did you know I needed you? A little bird told me. I'm yep. sorry, I should say three little bees. The bees we brought back then, huh? Well then, think we can get this swarm to stand down? I do. Bedtime for bees. So, how's production? Eh, jars of honey and no one to give it to. Come on. Damn, let me in there. I'm gonna gulp that all of that honey. Okay, scary part's done. Now we just have to get rid of those vines somehow. <laughs> you have no idea, Raz. All right, that's for Tuesday, getting rid of the vines. It's gonna be very sad and depressing. We're gonna help a depressed man undepress by going through his issues and... Yeah. At this point, it's no secret. It's going to be uh, the final of the Psychic Six. Um, Bob Zanotto. So Lily's granduncle. And Helmut's... Late Helmut's? He's not late, but what do you think? Is? Late Helmut's boyfriend. And... Oh my god, the mess in his head. It's, it's the, like they left the most depressing level for last. I get it. I get it. Well, still, well, before we do that, it's gonna also going to be a bigger episode. We're going to go and uh, finish off Hollis's hot streak. We know where that is. Psyching Sensorium as well. We have the power to go in there, get all the all the men, uh, mental vaults, are they called? Memory vaults? And Tomb of the Sarcophagus, which is, I think, also the memory vault. Yeah, pretty sure. And don't forget the outside area, the mother lobe. So we can get everything now. Go around. Yeah, that's how the next episode will start. Getting the last of the collectibles in the real world. But, you know, enough for today. It's been, wow, quite a quite a long stream for my standards. <clears throat> my throat is dying. Whoo! Thanks all for being here for the entire episode. It's a long one. And Hope you had fun. So that there's nothing until I was meaning. Uh, Thank you, Joseph. I was meaning. I, I meant Friday evening or Saturday evening. So not not tonight, of course. He's working, and I'll be asleep for one night, morning. But yeah, if whatever you find out, let me know. Let's see who's streaming now. Can we read? Skibidi boop, skabidi bop. Hmm. Sega fans playing something. Oh, Goemon. I remember that. Never played it. Seen a lot of posters. Let's read Sega fan. It's been a while. Rated the whole gang so far. In the last few weeks. Are we on? We are on. All right, folks. Like I said, thanks all for watching. And, uh, See you on Saturday in Outbreak, if nothing else. Bye. Bye. Go away, stream. There you go. Going away.